trial, I mean. Yes, the yes. best part. Let's I'll be honest, the best part about these games. I'm sorry, it just, they are. Wait, are we actually going into trial? Yeah. It's only like oh, 9.45, okay. it isn't that late. Yeah, dude, I, I can't just do the first investigation and call it a day. We would we would be in this case for fucking ever if we went at that pace. Really? Yes, I so. Anyway. Uh... Yeah, I'm not... I think, uh, I think... Jay, Jay How did the investigation go yesterday, Mr. Wright? Oh, you know, gray areas everywhere. Rather, the whole thing is one big gray area. <sighs> Don't worry about me, no matter what the outcome. I'm ready to accept my fate. Uh, of course, you are. I believe in you, sis. I don't. Mr. Wright. Let me offer you a word of advice. One second, I gotta get something out of my jacket pocket. Ah, here it is. I have some. Anyway, <laughs> hey, what's up? A defense attorney should never believe their client. Yeah, that's cool and all, but I do. The defendant is called to trial because they are suspected of wrongdoing. Mm -hmm. Never forget that. Mm hmm. Miss Sky, um. You remind me a lot of Mia. But, you know, there's one complete difference between you and her. And that is? You're not a defense attorney. So you don't really tell me how to do my job. I believe it's almost time for the trial. Yeah, mm. fuck you. Mm. Good luck, Mr. Wright. Yeah, fuck you. You're gonna fucking need it. So watch your attitude. Oh wow! Okay, <laughs> suck yourself. Never have Hubba Bubba. She doesn't. <laughs> Never. <sighs> My first trial without a face, without a Faye helping me. I am fucked. Yeah, you are, baby. No one's gonna bail me out. The you know what, Crow? <laughs> <laughs> Rack. Be alone in there. Yeah, yeah. What is Fuck. it? I have to discover the truth all by myself. Let's do it, Mr. Wright. I'll be with you the whole way. I don't oh, want you in there, god oh. damn it. Alright, we can find myself in hell. Thank Christ. You are the last person I want in that fucking room. Oh god damn it, there's even a sprite for her. Hi Edward. Shut the fuck I got the bill. Shut up! Court <laughs> is now in session for the trial of Miss Lana Sky. Jesus, that took a while. What the fuck? Whatever, well, I guess. Not. Let me just. Let me get serious. <clears throat> the defense is ready, Your Honor. The prosecution has been ready for a while, Your Honor. I forgot how fucking long that investigation segment was. Bloody hell! Let me have my fucking fun, asshole. Whatever. I'm getting my hubba bubba. You're not getting any. It's been two months, but I still haven't been in a courtroom since this case. Trial, whatever. I hope that personal feelings will not be a part of proceedings today, Mr. Wright. Hmm. I will choose the path I think is right, regardless of what those around me might say. The judgment to be made here is in our hands, not those of anyone else. Now, very well, it Mr. Wright. point. Yeah, it's called a court of law. That's how we operate. Your opening statement, please. Chief Prosecutor Lana Sky has committed an unpardonable crime. Not only this, mm -hmm. but she was rash enough to commit it in the prosecutor's office lot. In my fucking car! Wow, he's just forceful. He's just more forceful in person. Yeah, he's like he's a lot more everything. submissive in bed. However, she will oh. now pay for the rashness with her life. There was a witness to her crime. A professional witness. Well then, professional call whore. Your, call your first witness, Mr. Edgeworth. The prosecution oh, calls its first witness, Miss Angel Star, to the stand. <laughs> the cough up queen. Oh no. You are gonna hate this person. Oh, look at this, Edgeworth. Hmm? Haven't I seen you somewhere? Uh oh. <laughs> you ordered the caviar lunch, right? Oh, caviar! Oh, I've never eaten caviar before! Give me that! Woo. 
the judge's fucking gluttony is taking over right now, but okay. Whatever. Oh, I love caviar. <laughs> You've no- <laughs> <laughs> Ah, and for you, I have a fiesta bowl. I- No, thank you. Thanks. Take it. Will the witness state her name and profession? <laughs> she didn't even love you, I mean- Ah, oh. uh, and you, sir. Did you order the fingerprint lunchbox? Jesus Christ. It's just right It's right and it is, it is too early. Your name and profession, please. <laughs> well, Your Honor, how does it taste? Oh, this is why everyone raves about caviar. It's so tasty it hurts. I always thought caviar would taste like pickle to poker. Tapioca. What the heck does pickle to poker yes, taste tapioca. like? It's tapioca, tapioca not to poker. <laughs> I don't give a shit. Oh my like god! It. Name! Profession! Now! We're in a goddamn courtroom! Me? The name is Angel Star. Don't go forgetting it. Was that uh. so bloody hard? I find myself running Lunchland these days. Is that what you wanted me to say, Mr. Edgeworth? Yes! <laughs> I'm going to laugh at you the entire fucking court case, Edgy. Edgy. <laughs> take, take a breath, Edgeworth, take a breath. Oh, is that what you call him? Edgy? Don't you touch my name for him, you whore. No, David. He's edgy like a knife. Very well, wit. Please <laughs> interrupt. <laughs> Will the gallery please shut up? Please describe the incident to us. The prosecution will <laughs> wait. I'm not finished eating. <laughs> God fucking hurry it up! Hurry up, fat ass. Uh, very well, <laughs> Mr. Edgeworth. As you know, we usually call on the police to provide a description of the crime. I think she's eating her lunch. Your Honor, as Mr. Edgeworth has said to the court, I am a professional. Uh huh. What exactly does that mean? She's a whore. <laughs> Before that, until two years ago, Miss Angel Starr was a special investigator with the police. She was a first-rate homicide detective. Excuse me? What? Miss Starr was a detective? Well, ain't that a bitch. Ah! I, I, I know who you are. Uh, cough up, cough, cough up something. Cough up majesty, cough up duchess, uh... Cough up queen, oh. Angel Star, you're on. So you're telling me the judge and Angel Star had an affair? No, no, no. Uh, very well, uh, you, you, may, you may continue with the description, Miss Star. Just who the fuck is this chick? If I might have the court's attention over here... I would rather not. The parking lot at the prosecutor's office is divided into two blocks. Mm. A block is for the prosecutor's office personnel. B block is for visitors and clients. Mm -hmm. A chain divider separates the two blocks. Mm -hmm. I, I suppose. Oh wait. <laughs> I suppose that's to keep visitors from taking up the prosecutor's spaces, huh? The crime took place by a car in the back of A block in the car's trunk. The killer stabbed the victim with this knife and went to drive the body out of life. Unfortunately for nice. her, there was a. You can't do it. <laughs> I'm sorry. Unfortunately oh, for her, there was a witness. <laughs> God damn it! Well, you're the one who said it like that. With this <laughs> knife. <laughs> 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 this is made on the spot. And who was this valiant witness? Why, it was me, Your Honor. Oh, boy, you I'm, gonna, oh. I'm gonna. I'll be right back. I'll be right back. Uh, what witness? Why? Sorry. Did you Did you see the very moment of the crime? Of course, Your Honor. Immediately after that, I apprehended the chief prosecutor. Hmm. It seems rather cut and dry, doesn't it? Well, Mr. Wright? 
Sorry, I was shooting my hubba bubba. Uh, I can't agree on your principle, Your Honor. It seems that some poor losers are unwilling to accept the truth, Your hey! Honor. Hey! What the fuck? Damn! I see rush what little hope they have remaining. Oh god, she just went I to mean, a bitch. Zero damn. damage real quick. Huh. You wanna yeah. take it there? Miles, I'm... Mm. Yeah, I mean, if you can, they're giving me a worse, mister! All right, all right, split. So we, what we have here is a corrupt court system. <laughs> Witnesses <laughs> account. Here we go. Somehow, I always knew a day like this would come. I was on my way to deliver a lunchbox to my boyfriend. Which one? One of two. Yeah. When I sent something, perhaps it was my finally honed detective's intuition at work. Jesus. Through the wire fence, I saw the chief prosecutor standing next to a garish car. The chief prosecutor was holding a knife in her right hand. You should have said garish. Then she thrust a pointy tip of the knife into Detective Pippin's <laughs> chest. That's a pretty nice knife. Bringing a lunchbox to your boyfriend. How touching. Uh, Your Honor. Uh... She has, she has, uh, Your Honor, um, Edward, Edward, should, I, should, I, should I tell him? Oh no, I'll tell him. Your Honor. Okay. Oh, 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 okay, so it's like a favor then. No, 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 it's not a favor, it's a... Oh, oh, okay, oh, okay. Yeah, 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 yeah. Oh, oh, what? With, with the lunchbox? Jesus. Okay, <laughs> I'm just gonna yeah. put a stop to this. As you can see, there is no room for doubt. The key point of your testimony seems to be nothing other than uh, the point of the knife which you saw being stabbed in Detective Goodman. <laughs> As she had a nice nice. Wow, that was a good one. So, how does it feel to be so utterly crushed? Still thinking about that. It's Take all the time you need. It's, it's merely a flesh wound, Mr. Wright. Have you ever seen a diversity movie? I thought that's like a favorite movie. Em, you it's can't come out. Shut up. It's called her Emily. Hey, I, I like I like Monty Python and the Holy. Do you remember, remember that scene where like the the guy was like running at the castle and it was like really far away? Come, come on, Mister Wright, you never seen Monty Python? I love that movie. <laughs> I've never watched it in my life. Come on, we all the knights who say neat. Come, really, right? You're so uncovered. I hate it here. <laughs> Next. Press <laughs> specifically on the boyfriend part. Yes. This boyfriend, he's the detective. Not that boyfriend. Yes. <laughs> the security guard. That boyfriend. You have several. You see what you see? Yes. What I'm talking about <laughs> this boyfriend, that boyfriend, and the other boyfriend. Get <laughs> 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 the yet another boyfriend position is still open for applicants. Well, fucking shit! Uh, put me down. Uh, my name is first name your. Your honor. Your honor. Your honor. Your honor. Please. Right, I have not scored this fine piece of ass in thirty. No, years. no, 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 no. Let me, let me, let me whisper <laughs> something to you. Let me whisper something to you. So, so you know what? So, so you know how whenever <laughs> some people have sex with multiple people they have this thing called an std sometimes right i'm literally one foot in the rain already i don't give a shit you should care okay you know what i'll stick with the lunches thanks Don't just sell. what i'm saying is oh my god security guard room is in the lot in a block it's up on the second level, so you can see everything from there. That would be the room with the security sign, Emma. Incidentally, did you bring your lunchboxes by the car? I'm a visitor now, I parked in B block. So she was in B block when she witnessed the crime. Next. Next. So you should press on that one just so you can rag on Edgeworth about his car. 
No, I don't want my. I, I don't want. I don't want my fiance pissed at me more. Um, can I look at the evidence real quick? Can I look at the knife to see if it has any fingerprints? Pretty nice knife. No prints. Mm. Back. Next. Hmm. Can I look through the things and see how he's killed? Chest wound? Shit. 4.5 inch knife. How, how long is that joint's knife? How, yeah, how long is... <laughs> <laughs> His knife is not very long. Anyway. Back a couple? <laughs> Sex joke. Press? I'm sure. I'm sure Phoenix Wright would know. Oh, I do. By carn garnish, I mean, garnish. By by gayish, by by gayish car, you mean? You mean that's garish, not gayish? What are you talking about? He bought. He. Mr. Edwards' car. Trent, I've seen your garage. You have a blue Prius in there. Miss Mr. Edgeworths? Incidentally, the knife was the knife with which the victim was stabbed was also Mr. Edgeworth's. Wasn't it? Indeed it was. Oh, what sussy <laughs> What an odd case this is. You were sussy baka, Mr. Edgeworth. The person you saw, you are sure it was the defendant. I saw her from no further than thirty feet away. I am certain it was her. If she's telling the truth, then we're doomed. Let's just do whatever we can. Even if we don't have any proof, we can always nitpick. Nah, we're dealing with Edgeworth here. I need something more substantial than that. Hmm. Can you tell us what the suspect was doing when you saw her? Oh, you know, poking him with the fucking knife as if he was a fucking turkey. Whatever. Not that turkey. It's, it's a small knife, but it's a good knife. All that. Tell me more about this knife that the suspect was carrying. Well, I'd say the Wait. blade was about four inches long. It says the blade is 4.5. Is that right, Mr. Edgeworth? It is your knife, after all. Uh... The, the, it's still two different numbers. It has to mean something. Yes, that's that's about right. About. <laughs> yeah, for Prosecutors right. are by nature well versed in the location of a man's vital organs. What the hell does that mean? Sure, it was easier than boiling an egg for my egg salad surprise set. I'm going to fucking hate this lady. You can't testify as to her ability to kill, kill an egg. egg. I mean, a person. <laughs> The chicken salad set would have been a better metaphor. Oh, I'm sure ass so, would have been a better metaphor. So the defendant... I bet holding, it would have. A, the defendant was holding a knife. What then? I still say it's an inconsistency that the, she says the knife is 4, but the defendant <sighs> says 4.5. That's still a difference. Not probably... Um... Pro... Mm. Pro... Yeah. It's still, it's still enough to tell a difference. Uh, tell the court why you didn't stop this crime. You did rate. You did see her raise the knife to strike. No. Hmm. Defense has a point. Unfortunately, by the time I realized what was going on, it was already too late. Mm, sure. Too late. Yes. The next moment, the chief prosecutor brought down the murder weapon. I. I see. It's. It's only a flesh wound, Mr. Wright. We can make it. God. You said that before. Anything else? Do you want to fucking add? Um, let's see. Uh, the Knights Who Say Me? I, I don't know. I don't know too many references. Uh, scientifically speaking, Miss Star's testimony is flawless. Okay. That sounds pretty fucking fatal to me. What do we do? Is this it? Is my sister guilty? Yes. Let's keep our heads cool and present the witness a bit. Impress the witness a bit, okay? For some reason, having your panic next to me makes me calmer. Don't smile like that! What? Why, is, why do you enjoy my suffering? 
Because you're a 15 year old bitch. That too. Press. A 15 year old who looks like a 20 year old in 11th grade. How did you know? Doesn't make any sense. Prosecutor's basic aberrance of the crime. Yet their methods are ugly and twisted. Twisted methods will always lead to a tragedy. Oh, the lunch lady's uninformed opinion is duly noted and it also thrown in the garbage. <laughs> 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 yes, hardy ha ha, but whatever. Your your bad take ratio. Ratio. <laughs> That's a ratio. <laughs> ratio. Even that they are used to erasing inconvenient evidence at their whim. Killing off a detective that knew too much is merely an extension of that. Miss Star, do you have something personal against prosecutors? I felt that I had found my dream job when I became an investigator. Even if I hadn't been laid off by those prosecutors over there, I'd still be one. <laughs> laid off? She was fired. To me, prosecutors are nothing more than worms. That said, I am a pro, as you know. My testimony is unbiased and long. Bullshit! Oh, well, very well. Uh, actually, actually, I agree with her. Oh, 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 wow. So all of a sudden, you're wanting to have your client found guilty. Okay. Okay, guys, we're not fucking children, all right? Continue, please. You already oh, pressed no. it. Seems pretty right. fun. Also, Koriza is here. Hold it. The I judge is a simp. This is right. You sense something? So you're saying you had a premonition of the murder? It felt like... How would you say? Oh, yes. It was like the feeling you get when you view a pumpkin chock full of seeds. F huh? I, I have no idea what that means. I don't either. Anyway, speaking of the victim's intuition, uh, wasn't the victim, Mr. Bruce Goodman, also a detective? Yes. Well, he was like a young cheese. Oh uh, yeah. The fuck? Oh, my God. Are you speaking Spanish or something? Come on. A pale white cheese, not tangy with experience on the streets. A greenhorn. Why didn't you just say that from the fucking beginning? And I must be hard, yellowed, and sharp as a. T Why did I say it like that? Why did I say it like that? Because he's sipping for the hooker. That's what he's doing. Uh, 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 um, um, Your Honor, Your Honor, uh, Your Honor. Yeah. Your Honor, I think my like, knife can fix this. Your situation. Honor, do you want to talk? Do you want to talk? Look, do, my do wife hasn't. Look, my wife has not looked me in the eye since we had sex for like twenty years now. I don't know how to feel anymore. Oh, well, honey bunch. You okay. Order of old <laughs> cheese to match. Oh, wow. <laughs> in any case, there, in the lot, I felt something stirring in the back of my mind. Can you talk about how Emma's roast was the only good thing she's said so far? Okay. <laughs> okay. It's so only that, a flesh that... wound. So that means we have to find the contradiction. So what do you think it is, Sam? I still think it's the knife. Okay, can I look through the evidence? Next. Boy, go back to the defense attorney badge. Uh, no one would who? believe I was a defense attorney if I didn't carry this. True, true. Question, who... Yeah. Who was the chick's boyfriend? Uh, so which, like one, which one? Which one? The yeah, there's three. The, the security guard? The, the aforementioned third boyfriend? Corza, I don't wanna I don't wanna rehash jokes, but I will just quote Austin Powers. She's the village bicycle! Everyone's had a ride! Right, on. <laughs> okay, next. <laughs> hmm. I next. still think it's the knife. You don't just put four and four point five together and say, oh, they're similar enough. It has to be a difference. One knife wound died within an hour and a half. 
So what? That's like. Um, there's, there's no contradiction there. So he, wait, no, wait. Go back to the case file. Died within an hour. Okay, wait, real quick. So. 4.5 inch knife. So wait, the contra the contradiction would have been that he got there at 5:12. Yeah. So he bled out around. Five, between it was 5 four, right? four, four, yeah, he got no. Edward got there at five twelve, right? Yeah. And the cause, the time of death was between four and five thirty. Well, so Edward's a big time. So wouldn't he have been able to see the body? I mean, where do you want to press that then? Well, that's where I'm having an issue trying I still to think it's think. the knife. Well, think, think about this. Garnish car. Edgeworth wouldn't have been there if he got there at 5.12. That means he never had his hands on the knife unless they were transporting the body. Well, we're not th we're not talking about Edgeworth being the person that is at fault, you know, the murderer, someone else. I'm just thinking if he was there at 5.12, he would have the body. Okay. I don't know where to press that is the issue. Well, we already pressed everything. I know. So I still think it's the knife. It's a long shot, but four and four point five are still different numbers, even if they're similar. Especially in a knife. So she, I don't think she would be able to tell. She here's here's another, another question: question. What so, other character have we seen with a knife? Okay, this. Okay, this one. This was actually kind of. This one's actually kind of a low baller because she doesn't even have a statement about it. So apparently, remember when she said that she was on the. Apparently, she said that she was the one that apprehended, um, Lana, right? Yeah. Okay. Okay. So, what about that, huh? Um, and Lana. Wasn't she a prosecutor or something beforehand? Yeah. She was a detective. A detective. Um... So, she would be able to know the exact size of it because she's had experience right fuck um trying to think <laughs> um 518 there was a call made at 518 Yeah, the phone says it, uh, at 518. I still don't know. Um. Well, I'll, I'll just go ahead and tell you. It has something to do with the fact that she was the one that apprehended her. Next. Okay, well, go back to the case file and check it. Okay, um, let's see, uh, new disease, uh, lots of blood, well, there's nothing else, god damn it, um, okay, that's, she said she um, saw him get stabbed, right? Yeah, and she was the one that apprehended Lana. So, she let the guy bleed out for an hour and a half? No, it's, she, she you know, it says that he died between 4 and 5.30, not that he Okay, real quick, real quick, real quick. Can I go to the last statement? I just want to look. Okay, so that. Go back one. Um. Fuck, I don't know. I hate that we're basically doing something so similar to this right now in the forensics. Okay. So I'm like trying to use my. Knowledge for this I'll, shit. I'll go ahead and say this. Do you do you want me to tell you what the contradiction is? Um, sure. Okay. Well, unfortunately, it's deceiving because it actually doesn't fucking tell you this part. But whenever you pressed her, she said something about apprehending the suspect herself. The problem is, if you look there at there was a gate. Map, there's a gate. Yeah. Yeah. There's a big gate. So there it is. Okay. Apparently, was Objection. not that state. It was not that statement, it was the other one. Why? Fuck you, Wiki. What, the fucking- f the, uh, the sixth one? Like, the very last one? Yeah, apparently. What the fuck?! Uh, okay, I'm, give I'm... me a second. Six... Doesn't look like she's holding that. Oh, there she is. 
Wait, okay, wait. Wait a minute. Press the fourth state for shooting. Wait, so if the, we have to press... Hang on. Oh my god. I hate when these games do this. So you have to press the fourth one again after you press the second and first one. What the fu- Okay. Yeah, garish car. Mr. Edgeworths! Yes, it was my knife. Aha, uh -huh. chatter it up, fuck boys. I can't believe Edgeworths just called us. Alright, witness. Okay. In your testimony, you clearly stated the following. <laughs> Prosecutors are nothing more than words. Ergo. You are a biased witness. You might want to keep those silly opinions to yourself in the future, Rookie. I will slap you. F uh, f rookie? Try bitch. it, we're in court, bitch. Unless you're willing to risk the consequences of doubting me. Oh, 100%. I'll fry you like a fritter, crispy on the outside, chewy on the inside. F that bring it, bitch. That was inspiring. <laughs> I've never heard that tagline somewhere else. You could cry plagiarism? I may be relegated to the lowly post of lunch lady, but my instincts are honed. A, wait, a, a photograph? You took this? The moment I witnessed the crime, my reflexes took over. Yeah, I took a picture. In fact, one of my lunch boxes is rigged with a camera. Okay. I suppose that's more exciting than just hanging it around your fucking neck. Oh, oh, wait, wait a minute, witness. Yeah. Why, why am I the only? Why am I only seeing this photograph just now? You think I'd show it to you, a prosecutor? Think uh, again. Why <laughs> <laughs> right, fuck you, Edgeworth? Right. <laughs> right. I think I think I am about about to commit a a, a, a what is it, a crime. One of those. Do it! We're in court, bitch! <laughs> One of those. My boyfriend works in the photography division of Criminal Affairs. Oh, oh which my god, she's Karen. Which fucking one, bitch? I mean, well, this is most certainly the defendant. Uh, very much so. Look at him open that car. Mm. This is unmistakably Lana Sky. Okay, so what was the defendant doing at the time? Okay, then. Okay, yeah, 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 now, right? No, you go. Now! <laughs> Try it. Yeah, thank- I- Okay. Do the fifth one since it'll be easier. Okay. Yeah, this one I think is the fifth one. Present- present photograph. I am so confused. What the fuck? No, that's the four pants. Try it, next one. Crime- yeah, it's the crime photo. Okay. Yeah, you kept trying to do the fucking other one, so I was guessing you might as well- you should have done it this way. Apparently I was- And you witnessed this? You saw Miss Sky stab the victim with the knife? As if I've already said, yes! I swear it on my finest city bunch! I hate this bitch. I'm sure I hate a... you too! I'm sure that's a fine lunch! Yum yum. Mm. But isn't that odd? Look at the photograph! This is the photograph you took at the very moment of the crime, is it not? Then why is Miss Sky not holding a knife? Ahem. Uh, Mr. Edgeworth, your thoughts? Objection. I'm not even gonna put effort- I'm not even gonna put effort in this one, I'm, I'm just so done. Regular objection. That had to be the weakest objection ever, Edgeworth. Eat my ass right. Yet it was okay. so it was still stronger than your ever feeble mind, Mr. Wright. What do you mean, Mr. Edgeworth? This photograph was not taken the moment before the stabbing. This was taken the moment after the stabbing. Objection! And how can you tell that, huh, bitch? What's better? Excuse me. I don't even see it. See the dark crimson stains on the chief prosecutor's coat? Oh, we would if it wasn't black and white! But it's a, it's a black and white photograph. Well, uh, yeah, I mean, it's hard to tell, but, I mean, this could be blood. Or 
brownie sauce. I don't know. Wait. Or ketchup. Do you have a jacket on? <laughs> well, Mr. Wright, I see no problem here. No problem. No problem except. No. Oh, wow. Except wow. you. Mr. Wright, are you just going to sit there and take that kind of abuse? I'm going to take off my fucking. But you know what? Objection. Fuck you, objection. Wait, that contradicts what the witness said in her testimony. Namely, that she took the picture the moment she witnessed the crime. Well, it seems I was slightly unclear. My apologies. Oh, shut up. That's it? If you run out of lunch, you order seconds. Problem solved. If you don't like it, try ordering the jumbo size lunch from the get go. Good advice. Not sure I understand. Fish what? Good advice. I didn't have time to stop her. Prosecutor Sky was cold, calculating like a robot. Speak world without pain or remorse. It was a premeditated murder. Oh, objection! Premeditated? How do you know that? Look at the chief prosecutor's hands in that photograph. Oh, well, are those gloves? Surgical gloves made of thin rubber, most likely. Why would she have those on? I don't know. What do I have the knife. On? The knife didn't have prints on it. Yeah. If it was not premeditated, she would not be wearing those gloves. One. What was that face? <laughs> <laughs> wow, you really want to give a yeah, wow? All right. I mean, the knife—the knife did have no fingerprints on it. Yeah, I mean that's because she wore gloves. Okay, these gloves do seem to tell a tale of premeditation. I bet it's a really funny tale. I bet it's gonna make me laugh and cry and sob like a little bitch. <laughs> <laughs> Premeditated murder, a serious offense. Witness, add this to your testimony. Okay, here it is. The murder was planned! The rubber gloves prove it! Alright, well, guess what, knife? Objection. Objection! Witness, do you know what this is? Are you trying to test me? I sell box lunches for a living, you know. That's why I'm asking for in the first place. That's a knife. The the knife that was in Mr. Edgeworth's trunk. Indeed, it is my knife. Yeah, murder it's up! What's with this case? The bloody murder weapon! A red car, all belonging to the prosecutor there? That is a chief prosecutor of the district, right? Bobby, are prosecutors oh, bad people? Yes. The defense of the request. We ask that the witness provide an Accurate testimony. Ricky. Oh. In your testimony, you stated that Lana Sky planned this murder. And this is why she was wearing those special gloves. Seems like a natural conclusion to me. The gloves do indicate planning. However, why would she not also prepare the most important thing? The murder weapon. Mm, fuck you, bitch. I just having to be there in the trunk of the car. Ladies and gentlemen, if you're going to plan a murder, you don't forget the weapon, asshole. Yeah, fuck your uh, fucking fuck your food. Order, 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 order. Do we? I'm not gonna. I'm. Do I have to send you to time out again? Do I have to? I will. You will. I will. I will, I will take the time out. I will, take away your, I will take away your Nintendo Switch. I'm not kidding. Great, now the tide is turning in our favor. Great show, Mr. Wright. My sister's as good as free. That's oh, not tisk, at all. Tisk, right. Edgeworth, I'm, you're very close to a divorce. I believe the next lunch you'll be eating is... <laughs> Humble Pie! <laughs> yeah! 
Not a titter. Wow. Okay. Well, you people are hard to impress. <clears throat> hey, hey, Emma. Real quick. <laughs> Do you want to sell a ring for a pretty penny? <laughs> right. I got that. Whoa! Whoa! Are you kidding me? I got that fucking ring from K's. Are you? Are you serious? <laughs> okay. Oh, sorry. Then I won't give it to her. I'll go sell it at a pawn shop. Oh my god! You're actually doing this right now. You're actually, okay. You have a dude. Today is not a good day for any of us. I'm gonna be completely honest. Oh, how the fuck do you think I feel? People are chattering up a storm about me, about me being a murderer. You think you yeah, I'm thinking you're some kind of fucking innocent officer's pity. Uh, can you guys just not fucking have your divorce like now? We we gotta travel yeah. you. Okay, okay. I hope you weren't deluding yourself into thinking that the tide has turned. It's not almost such a trifling detail. But this shoots a hole in the whole fucking premeditated theory. Ah! The prosecution could care less if it was premeditated or not. The only one who seems to care is that lunch lady over there. The defendant, Lana Skye, murdered a detective with a knife. <laughs> that is the only thing the prosecution needs to prove. Nothing else. Mm -hmm. Very good, Mr. Prosecutor. I suppose you think you're clever now. Yeah, but you know as well as I do that she planned on killing him. It was planned. Yeah. If it wasn't, why would she have been wearing... Okay, I be like, I believe I'd like to hear your testimony, guys. Can we just calm down? Like, you know, I we got we got some tensions, right? But like, we're all we're all friends here, right? We're all friends. Okay, real quick, Your Honor, I would like to say something. Yeah, go ahead. Mr. Uh, I'm not gonna say I'm not gonna say it in public. I'm to you, did you know that an innocent officer just walked into fucking Edgeworth's office just to give him a case because he he was told to by his instructor and and in defense. And we're just right. Pay. right, this isn't a fucking high school. Why are you just telling me gossip right now in the middle of a trial? Because Fuck. I'm fucking mad! Okay, witness... Right, grow the fuck up. And witness, please tell us only what you saw, not what you thought you thought. How dare you? Oh, how dare you? That's either what you sound like. My powers of deduction are to not be underestimated. Mm. Oh, what was that? You're probably of what? You are a whore. <laughs> <laughs> I didn't imagine that stance. Yeah, all of our characters are just kind of just being a bunch of peanut gallery people in the stands. Like, Gumshoe's like, yeah! Fuck you, lady! That's a nice knife down there. I want to have a leg. Ain't nobody care about your motherfucking knife. This guy intended to make it And that's why she called the victim all the way to the prosecutor's office. I'm sure the chief prosecutor had a grudge against the victim. Nothing else could drive that human machine to plunge the knife in again. Wait again. a minute. <laughs> he says he was only stabbed once. Yeah, he was only stabbed well, once. Dumb bitch. Wow. My God. Could you just take one good look at the court record? My word. Okay. The victim was summoned from the police department <laughs> to the prosecutor's office. It does sound a lot like premeditation, doesn't it? So if I ordered a pizza, does that mean I'm planning to kill the delivery boy? Yes. Wait, what? <laughs> right. Where the fuck do you keep finding these girls? Like, I gotta ask, where do they keep coming from? First off, this is the victim's sister. Not the victim, oh. sorry, the murderer's sister. Cool. Why? She came to my office, said, hey, defend my sister. I'm like, yeah, sure, okay. And I went to go do shit, and now she's just following me. Well, that's that's, just... Just, that's beautiful. Okay, in any case, the defense may now cross-examine the witness. I'm so stressed, and Edgeworth won't even allow me a fucking daughter. Main one. She said again and again. It says she was yeah, almost yeah, once. Yeah, just, yeah, you, Trent, you already know. Yeah, we already know. Oh, only, only, again and again. Yeah. Objection! You say she stabbed him again and again. But you couldn't have witnessed that. Are you testing me? Then I'll test you. With my moss surprise! Yeah, that's cool. 
I'm afraid the moss is growing under our feet as we wait, Miss Star. She's pissed. <laughs> Fuck her. What? Wow, what do you Someone's out for blood today. I should I'm out for her to... fucking neck. Okay, I shouldn't have to explain this, but take a look. The autopsy report states that the death was due to a loss of blood from one stab wound. Aha! You're right! Good show, Mr. Edgeworth! What a hunk! He's my hero, really! Hmm. What about my inject- what the fuck? Why am I- You know what? I fucking hate all of you. Well, I think this is how see. I become- I think this is how I become asexual. <laughs> oh my god, I just looked at the lunch. You got the kind <laughs> <thing> set, right? <laughs> uh, wow. G okay, um... No thanks. How'd that knife fit in the box? I always believed that no one could ever mistake ketchup for blood. But now I realize that such mistakes are possible. I'm going... Mm. Okay. So you, you're you saying you mistook something for blood. When she lifted her knife, I thought I saw blood at her breast. Bloody blood from her victim! That's why I thought she must have stabbed him at least twice. Well, okay, then tell us what you saw you thought was blood. TESTIFY! Her red no, muffler no. looked like blood to me. That's how ghastly the whole scene was. Okay. What? Red? What? Huh? No. Like a scarf thing? God, no, not press, God damn it. Whoops. <laughs> <laughs> the fucking deep qu- Whoops. Her, her red muffler? Yes, like a scarf. The chief prosecutor always wears one around her head. Yeah, no. It can be easily hanged at a moment's notice, I suppose. Is that something no. you have to bring up? She is not right. Oh. Wait, was it red? Yeah, I think it, I'm pretty it sure was red. Yeah, was it, it was wasn't it orange? Red. No, it no. was red. But wait. Isn't it odd that you mistook that for splattered blood? Well, people often mistake my beard for a bib. <laughs> what? <laughs> oh. I judge with a bib. That's why I was. I want to cry. Do it, bitch. Cry. Cry like a bitch. I do think I saw some traces of blood on her chest. However, the autopsy report is clear on this matter. There is only one knife wound. Apparently, Miss Star isn't entirely sure of her own testimony. Mr. Wright, this is our chance! Chance for what? I wonder. <sighs> Miss Star has turned out to be short tempered as she looked when she should be met her. Stab. Challenging her abilities as a detective really set her off. Short wick burns out the fastest. It's a scientific fact. I will slap the shit out of you. Wouldn't it. It's not a scientific fact. Wouldn't it depend on the size of the fucking candle? I mean, add more wax, and even a really short fucking wick will burn longer. Obviously, more scientific testing is required. I fucking hate you. Okay, since we're focusing on the muffler right now, what do you want to look at? Yeah, the muffler. Yeah, uh, present. <coughs> Let's go to the photo. The recent. Yeah, that one. <gasps> oh. Yeah, present. Yeah, present. OBJECTION! Miss Star, I demand an explanation. OBJECTION! The witness is clearly not suited for detecting- <laughs> Well, look at that, everyone. Bork is playing Animal Crossing New Horizons. Hoorah. Good for you. What? I said, listen, listen, have you played Animal Crossing New Horizons? I do. I have my own island. I have, I have, I have that cat, um, what's his name? Raymond. He's very annoying, honestly. For a second, I thought you were going to say you have Anka, and I was about to no, lose my no, fucking shit. No, I don't have Anka. Jesus Christ. Put it back in your pants. 
the suspect was not wearing a scarf or muffler of any kind when she stabbed the victim. And you've proved it yourself with this photograph! Huh? But, but that, that can't be! Only a professional... Raven, we bitch. Only a professional lunch lady could be so utterly clueless. <laughs> Americans. Congratulations. Perhaps you found, finally found your true calling in life. Being a dumbass. Mmm, harsh words, but good. Sick burn, Mr. Edgeworth. In the end, Mr. Edgeworth prevails. I hate every single one of you motherfuckers. Like, I think all y'all motherfuckers need to rework y'all self. No, not that, but big bread, really. Well now, where were we? The witness has given us an entertaining interlude, but back to business. Did my mic cut out? Yeah. Yeah. Oh. What? Uh, very well, witness. Continue your testimony. You saw the crime and apprehended the suspect. Tell us about that. Very well. Why'd you look at me like that? Now I'm scared. I do remember some things accurately, at least. Oh, some things. Mm. Ultimately, we couldn't shake the most important part of her testimony. I'm just, I'm just shaking in my Oxfords right now. <laughs> The most important part. How can you read my mind? I was thinking that. What the fuck? I can read my mind, Mr. Wright. Uh, the my part sister. where your sister stabbed the fucking victim. What do you mean? You mm. This next testimony might be the moment of truth. The moment of truth. Apprehending the suspect. Apprehending the sus. After the murder, the suspect attempted to run behind a partition off to the other side. I quickly caught her, expla explained her rights to her, and arrested her on the spot. Ah, <laughs> uh, yes. When I arrested her, she mentioned the muffler. That's what had me confused in my earlier testimony. Why would she the mention the fucking muffler? Shut the fuck up. <laughs> the chief prosecutor made to escape, but against Angel Star, resistance is... Futile. Tile? I don't know how to pronounce that word. <laughs> you are quite determined about this scarf, aren't you? I strike like a snake and bite like a cobra. Jesus, what? That's me, Angel Star. You know, it wasn't a very good metaphor. First of all, a cobra is a kind of snake. Don't bother me with details unless you want to get bitten. Bitch. Uh, yeah, no, I'll leave that up to my. Uh, That's why she's fiance. a whore. Note to self, Mr. Wright <laughs> is weak against poisonous snake bites. I will kill you. The prosecutor tried to resist, but her efforts were in vain. She knocked my hands aside, kicked over an oil drum. Excuse an, an oil drum? Hard to imagine. Beautiful, but deadly. A predator, this one. A leopard woman. <laughs> wow. Uh, okay, very well, Mr. Wright. It's just, take, just, just take this one. I'm, I'm getting quite exhausted of this witness. Will another yeah. one change your mind? No. I wasn't talking to you. Uh, yeah, I don't give a shit. No one cares you're about talking your fucking to me. Witch. I'll Mr. use my Wright. knife. Mr. Wright, remember when you got me those tropical flavored Skittles? Yeah, of course. I want another pack. The machine. <laughs> I got some bad news. I got some bad news. For you. Told what? the vending machine it's down. No! <laughs> I, I didn't think that was gonna get brought up again about Skittles being needed, but then I remembered. Oh, someone told the fucking vending machine it's down. <laughs> the fact that came full circle. What curse so hell awesome. have we been managed to? I get out of Skittles. <laughs> Hey Emma, real quick, can I check your purse? Yeah, what is it? What do you want? Oh yeah, let me just let me just. Oh, okay, wait here, here, Your Honor. There's some tropical, <laughs> some tropical skulls in her purse. Your Honor, the, uh, Mr. Rat, this is a this is a box of Tic Tacs. 
Oh, shit. Hey, Tic Tacs okay. are good. Tic Tacs are good. I, how about you try one? Fine, I will try to take just cross examine the damn witness already. All right, tell me how it is after I'm done cross examining. Um, run behind a uh, well, next. I don't really see anything about that being important. Uh, why did she? Yeah, this one bugged me. Why did she do that? She's not even a fucking police officer. Press. You see quickly. Were you close to the suspect? Oh, I'm eating cheeses. <laughs> uh, 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 Ella. As I just said, sorry, I'm eating cheeses. <laughs> oh shit! She got the good shit. I was only thirty feet away from her the whole time. Hmm. Maybe I should press her for more details. I'm not gonna yeah. press the sta same sta uh, Um. Yeah, sure. I'd like to see this on the floor plans, just to be safe. The Lunchland car was... <clears throat> she was in the... She was a visitor, thus she was parked in B Block. That's Edgeworth. <laughs> oh wait, oh, sorry, yeah, uh, B Block. Ooh, okay, yeah, go. <laughs> so you witnessed the murder from here... Don't worry, baby, I got you. I'll make it about 30 feet from the car, yes. These these tic tacs are busting actually. Right. <laughs> <laughs> Is that correct, Miss Star? Yes, that's right. Oh, oh that reaction. Well, wasn't there a chain link fence in front of you? I went over it, of course. <laughs> wow! Amazing! Pop up Queen Lunch Lady Athlete indeed! I'm taking her a little time to climb up over the fence, though. So she, she couldn't have gotten at my sister that fast. I mean, she's alright. Oh, cool. Yeah, the fence was about nine feet tall, too. How did Miss Sky not get away? An interesting question. Uh, why did you. Again, you're not a fucking cop. Why are you arresting people? There is, a, there is such a thing called citizen's arrest. Still, yeah. press. Hold it. She mentioned the muffler. Why? Yeah. Also, why did? Why would she mention the fucking muffler? If I remember exactly, I would have told you in my testimony. Cheeky fucking bitch. Anyway, all I heard her say was the word muffler. Just that one word. So, what you heard wasn't the suspect talking to you, but to someone else. Yes, the chief prosecutor was talking on her phone. Her phone? Can you she remember? can't mean. That's okay. That was talking to Emma. Ask okay. further. By phone, do you mean this cell phone discovered at the crime scene? Yes, ultimately. Ultimately? My memory. It's like a salmon heading upstream, you see. Oh. That's the worst metaphor. The court doesn't see, Miss Star. The chief prosecutor first attempted to use the phone hanging on the wall. On the wall? That's right, near the car. There was an emergency cell phone on the wall. Apparently, it was out of order. That checks out. So she used her cell phone. Indeed, the emergency phone was out of order that day. That's very inconvenient. Mm, good witnessing, witness! <laughs> you, you okay, Judge? Yeah, these these Tic Tacs are... What are these? Orange flavored? Dude, I think I like Tic Tacs orange flavored now. These, these are um, um, uh, real, qu real quick, Em, what flavor are those Tic Tacs? Uh, they're, I think they're orange flavored? I don't know. I just, I've never okay. Them. I mean, what... what your Honor, can, can I see the case of those Tic Tacs real quick? No. I, no, I just, I, I just, <laughs> I just, I want to check no. the export no. date real quick. I, I don't, no, I don't want to. I want to eat more Tic Tacs. Okay, right. Your Honor. You should, of course, add this to your testimony while I finish these Tic Tacs. The things I, I do to please this rookie defense attorney. 
Oh, she called you a rookie. I'm gonna take that and strike. <laughs> just slurp the tic tacs. <laughs> that was disgusting, but whatever. Oh, oh. oh she okay, tried well. the phone on the wall, but had to use her cell instead. Well, Phoenix Wright logic. If she adds a uh, statement to her testimony, that's usually where the contradiction is. What do you think it is? Mmm. Part. Wait. Mm. Saw so, uh, how she tried the phone on the wall. Uh, for floor pan. Because isn't there a wall between the two? <laughs> Just real quick, look at the floor pans, actually. I just want to double check. Yeah, there's a fucking wall! You can't see that! Oh, uh, well then. Boom. Uh, 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 hold it. Miss Star, I have to conclude that you have a personal grudge against- OBJECTION! Objection! The witness is a former detective. Her mm -hmm. testimony is unmo- Wait, why am I saying that? It is very much marred by personal bias, but- Oh, okay. real, real quick, real quick, Edgeworth, Edgeworth, look at this floor plan. You see how she said that she saw, like, her trying to get the yeah. the wall phone? You see that fucking wall there? I do, I see the wall. Well, who would have thought you would be my knight in shining armor, prosecutor? Don't talk to me. You, who together with the chief prosecutor, kicked me out two years ago. And I'd do it again. <laughs> yeah, he would too. I know how yeah, spiteful he would. is. Oh my god, anyway. Well, uh, Miss Star. Uh, <clears throat> this is a fatal connection. How can you explain that? Hmm. I don't know what you're talking about. <laughs> it's like a fucking little kid. Mess with me, and I'll make you cough it all up. I will slap the shit out of you. I'm not afraid. Anyway, what are the floor plans, harlot? You said you witnessed the crime from this point. However, if that's true, you couldn't possibly have seen Miss Sky phone. <clears throat> I believe you see what I'm getting at. That inversion phone was on the back side of this, uh, this wall. No, shut up. This wall. If indeed you were in B block, you couldn't have seen it. What? Order! Order! I, I love this theme song. What is the meaning of this? It's simple, Your Honor. She's not cuffing up lunch, she's coughing up lies. Oh! <laughs> Objection! Bitch. That's quite a claim, Mr. Wright. Perhaps you will allow me a question. Tell us yeah, exactly sure, what what's... Tell me exactly what lie this witness has told... Why am I saying this? I... I know exactly what lie you told the court, but alright, cuba me. What lies? L list them all. After Here's where the counterattack begins. I can't afford to get this wrong. <laughs> Oh my god, there's fucking colognes in here! <coughs> yeah, I'm fine, just... No, it's not a cough drop, I just fucking... It's like, for some reason, it, it feels like quarter cologne in my mouth. Is it the uh. Tic Tacs? <coughs> I think they're expired! The... Is it the, it's the Tic Tacs? I think the Tic Tacs are expired. Oh my god. Really? Your Honor, I think you're poisoned by the Tic Tacs. Oh, well, man, this is... Oh, 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 my chest! Is it the expired last <sighs> January? Right, if you're done it is November. Yeah, oh, oh. Yeah, okay, well, if you're done having a cardiac arrest, then please, what did you oh. slide about? Fuck, give me a second. Oh my god, I have the thought, it's just... Oh my god, where she saw it? Fuck! Oh shit. No. Oh, no! <laughs> Trin! Oh, well, I mean, that does make sense, though. She didn't see it. <laughs> Oh my god, she didn't see the sky using that. Does seem hard to imagine how she could have. Very logical. Mm, what's the matter, Star? Cat got your lunchbox? Uh, Mr. Wright, I hate to bother you while you're celebrating your victory, but why would Miss Star lie like that? Because she's fucking stupid. What do you mean? Why would she say that my sister had tried to use the phone but failed? Doesn't make any sense. Why lie about something so insignificant? 
<sighs> Fuck, she's right. I mean, maybe she really did see her try to use the emergency phone. I see no room for doubt here. Mm, of course you don't. It's your fucking... You know what? I don't know what... How to say that word. Pute. Patui. Oh. Patui. Patui? What is this kid Acres uprising? Mr. Rat, I thought you had something there. Oh, well, but I guess I just misclicked. Oh, it looks like you misclicked, right? Except it wasn't. It was Trent. You fucking dumbass. Yeah, well, okay. yeah, well guess what? It goes fucking put my hand somewhere else it, couldn't, it shouldn't have been. Where she saw it, right? Yeah, where she saw it. Uh, this guy tried to use the emergency phone. Then, uh, did you did it cut out? Whatever. But she, uh, yeah. but it was out of order. What is significant about this fact? Nothing. Therefore, it would be pointless for Miss Star to lie about it. Trent. Okay. Pointless to lie. I see. But say the witness did actually see Miss Sky using the emergency phone. It would mean. The witness, uh, the Miss Star witnessed the crime from a different location. Objection! A different location? Now that's a pointless lie if I've ever heard one. Objection! Before you call my lie pointless, at least let me tell it, asshole. Let me ask a question to our clever wordsmith, Mr. Rack. Just where right. was the witness when she saw the criminal? All the testimonies we've heard until now point in one direction. The place from where Miss Star witnessed this crime was here. Oh fuck! I don't know. Bro, well, it's definitely oh. somewhere left of this wall, right? Yeah. So it has to be in in there. It has to be like in the probably the security room. Okay. I'd say the fucking security room because like she has a boyfriend in there or some shit. Anyway, this is the only place where she could have seen it. The security the guard room. <laughs> Indeed, mm -hmm. the security room in the underground parking lot is well positioned. It's built on the second floor, so you can see the entire lot. Mm, she would have been able to see the emergency phone from there. But why there? How many other places where she could have seen the phone? Yeah, but you don't see a fucking... Mm, whatever. <sighs> not in this case, Your Honor. The witness not being part of the prosecutor's office couldn't park in lot A. I know it says block, but I'm just gonna say a lot because it sounds better. The only place where she could have seen the crime and uh, the back of the participant is here. I remember in your testimony, you said you brought a lunch to your boyfriend in the security guard room, yes? Well, Miss Star? How many years have I been getting the better of men? I think that the tables could be turned. Today, a man has got the better of Angel Star. Mm, you fucking better, asshole. Order, order, witness. What have you done? You used to be a detective. You should know better. Bad, bad. Go, go think about what you've done. Go to your room. Are you treating me like a dog or a child? Jeez, he's treating you like a. Real quick, real quick, Your Honor. May, I, may, I, may I say? Uh, right. Please let me have this. Please, I need this. All right. Okay, just go, go ahead. Go ahead. All right. He's treating you like a bitch. No, okay. All right. That's not what I wow. thought. Wow. But... Good one. Okay. Female clever. dog. Fuck you. Um, off topic, but Trent, look at chaotic status real quick. Uh, now? In the middle of our stream? Oh, <laughs> well, you can do it later. His status says Trent is my wife. Oh, that's cool. All right. Keep, I'm keep not going. turning back. Mm -hmm. The guilty will be punished. And I'll do what I must to make sure justice prevails. Yeah. The guilty. Is she talking about Miss Sky? Uh, Mr. Wright, doesn't this strike you as odd? Why did Miss Star lie? Doesn't make sense. What do you mean? She would have just said she saw the crime from the security guard station. It wouldn't change anything. 
Exactly. This photograph tells all. It was the defendant who stabbed the victim. That truth still stands. Hmm. Still stands. I disagree, Mr. Edgeworth. What? If a witness is found to be lying, they're guilty of uh, perjury. Per she knows this. Perjury. Yeah. I know. I, I, I fucked it up. Yes. Lying witnesses. We've never had those before. She wouldn't risk that without a good reason. So tell us what her reason was, Mr. Rat. Uh, me? Who else? Mr. Maybe Rat. the person fucking lying? Let's reveal what we know. We don't know shit. <sighs> Miss Star witnessed the crime from the security guard room. She lied and said she was she saw it from B. It must make a vital difference, but what? What would have changed? Distance the crime probably distanced no. Wait, 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 wait. She was in the security guard room. And Where is the security guard? Angle of view of the crime? Yeah. <sighs> Why the and angle at which she... <sighs> I, I see look it. At, look at that. Uh, oh my fucking god, Crow. <laughs> oh my god. Uh, Why is continuing? Her would change. The angle? What do you mean? Um, well, uh, the security guard station is on the second floor, and, uh, she would have sort of, sort of, she would have sort of a more 3D view of the crime. And this is important, why? Um. Wait, what? No, but I thought, I thought because, uh, how would she take the picture? From the other side of the fence, if she if she was in the side, but, come on! No, no, no. I I feel like you're on the right track, but I think it is the distance because she said she could hop the fence. But the security guard thing is on the second floor, Man, and she was on the the ground level where the cars were at. Okay, but I'm just gonna save just in case. But yeah, okay. So it's the distance. Okay, okay, game. Sorry for being smart. It changes the distance between her and the scene of the Objection! Objection! My condolences, Mr. Wright, but one look at the floor plans and it's quite clear. Mm -hmm. The distance between the scene of the crime and the guard station is 30 feet. What is on the second level? <laughs> I don't see how that would change what she could see. Mm -hmm. yes. What she saw is not in question here. What yes, matters is the time it, t it would take to for her to reach the scene of the crime. Oh, yeah. oh shit. I was right. Yeah, uh huh? Yeah, you're right, oh shit, you asshole. Miss Star, you witnessed the crime from the security room station. Now, how long did it take you to get there? From there, I mean. To the scene of the crime where you were arrested, Miss Sky. Okay, first of all. You can call the character an asshole, but not me! <laughs> well... Wait, I was helping you! Yeah. Oh, boy. Uh, wait, are you talking to me? Did I call him? No. Oh, okay. Well, Apple. witness! Thank you, Mr. Wright. Well, witness! You. Yo. What up, bitch? You ordered the squid wheels, right? No, I didn't order any fucking thing. God damn it. It, it looks like a bunch of fucking... What are they called? Curly fries. Not curly fries. No, they look like onion rings. I was bringing a PB&J lunch with my fresh boysenberry jam to my boyfriend. Uh-huh. Mm. Boysenberry for the boy... I see. That's... That's a little cute. <laughs> he wasn't in the station, so I waited. I witnessed the crime from the glass walled station. Oh. I 
before I knew what I was doing, I found myself running towards the scene. Mm -hmm. But the door was locked. I couldn't open it. Look at him go. Look at her go. <laughs> so I'm just booking it. <laughs> Look at her go. There's no possible way. <laughs> that's why I had to go through the visitor's parking in Beelot. That's uh, that's quite a detour. Look at how, look at how fast the little W's going. He's like, boop, 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 boop. look at him. Look at him go. I was a track in high school. It probably took me at least five minutes <laughs> to get to the seat of crime. Jesus oh, Christ! God. No possible, no shot in fucking five minutes to get there. No fucking five way. Five minutes. Good fucking. Hey. I could make. I could literally make a sandwich and eat it in the amount of time it took you to get to that crime scene. Your Honor, I I have I want you immense doubt. to try doubt. and hit around in these heels. Okay, fair point. Fair point. This changes things considerably, though. But it was that woman over there in the defendant's chair who stabbed him. I know it. I have photographic evidence. You are really pushing swear, it that I was there. I swear it on my finest plastic spork. <laughs> You have a point, and the spork is a wonderful invention. I mean, a spoon and a fork. A genius. Just Thank you. Beautiful. Would you like another caviar lunch? Absolutely! Oh my god, wait, what the fuck? Dude, judge, quit reading my mind! I hate it here. I love my caviar. Mr. Wright, you have to do something. He's going to eat all the caviar. I will have to have a single bite. Have you ever Um. Um. Trying to think. What would the fucking. Uh, object? I don't think there is. No, don't take that fucking. Mm. Um. Well. I'm trying to think. Could you look at the time, the time of something? Okay, yeah, sure, let's raise an objection. I don't know if I had to- oh, I had to provide evidence. OBJECTION! Five minutes between the witnessing of the murder and the- Think about it. You could have made pa- <laughs> I want to see you make pasta in fucking five minutes. You could make pasta in that amount of time, if you like it all Dante. I've got lunch mixes that tie pasta into knots, rookie. Nah, you're stupid. A five minute blank. Isn't that strange? Strange? Not really be slow. If you were a criminal, what would you do with five minutes, Your Honor? Well, uh, well, I guess I'd flee the scene. Hey! <laughs> don't, don't put the wrong idea! I, I didn't kill anyone! But you have the instincts of a killer. You would run. But this time was different. Miss Skye dwaddled at the scene of the crime. She had even taken her Waddles. pictures. No true criminal would act this way. It's incon inconceivable. Yeah. Nope. No. Well then... <sighs> It seems we've come to the end of this testimony. The witness has a grudge against the defendant and a blank in her testimony. Uh, Mr. Edgeworth, is the next witness ready to go? Unfortunately, I appear to have overestimated the witness on account of her professional history. We did it! Shut the we fuck up, prosecutor. We screwed that can shut, Mr. Wright. We? Oui, what did you fucking do? I helped. You gave the judge fucking expired Tic Tacs. I'm afraid that the cough-up queen has been dethroned. <laughs> yeah, judge! Let's fucking go! I get one this time. Yeah! And with that, court is adjourned. Consider your application withdrawn. What? Mr. Edgeworth, you ordered the squiggles, right? Thank you.
<laughs> that literally looks like he threw a bunch of rubber bands on rice. That looks disgusting. That's the one she tried to voice on off on me. I prefer to not take the defense's team's leftovers. Anything else to say? I'd be able to save you. I have decisive evidence. Mm -hmm. Okay, even I'm tired of this bitch. What the fuck? What was that? <laughs> if this is another fucking updated autopsy report, I'm going to shit bricks. My apologies, but we have no further questions to ask of you, Miss Star. Get the fuck out. Uh, is this your jumbo lunchbox? Oh my god, Your Honor, please. Please. I will not be influenced by food. I won't. <laughs> <laughs> oh, no, God damn it. Alright, 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 alright. <laughs> Out of witnesses, out of the first determination, oh I'll God. allow one more. Oh, I get the jumbo size this time. Ooh. Okay, Let's yeah, hear about real this. Quick. Real what? quick, real quick, real quick. Yeah? Okay, so, you see this, you see this lunch? I, I'm, I'm holding your lunch in my hand. Do you see this shit? Yeah. In the trash. It's what? gone. Why did you do that? Right, why? Because... All of you in this fucking courtroom have been nothing but assholes to me for no apparent fucking reason. I gave fucking... I'm going to be the most petty bitch right now. I was petty with fucking Von Karma. I'll be petty to you. I have been nothing but saying I'm giving everything. And then everyone ignores my shit. I have been too fucking dedicated to this shit right. to not get fucking... Right! Right! Right, right, take a breath. Take a, br take a breath. Breathe. There you go. There you go. I'm sorry. He, he gets like this sometimes when people are being dumbasses. Just, I know. I hate you too, right? I hate you too. Just let Your Honor, I will buy you whatever you want after court. <sighs> what the fuck is she gonna pull out of that ass now? Decisive evidence. This is evidence, my ass. I should have mentioned those five minutes when I wasn't looking at the crime scene. No, you sure have. And now, to the matter of the victim's shoe. Did I not bring this up? Oh my god. Three types of blood were found on this shoe. One was, of course, the victim's. And the other blood type mm. matched out of the defendant, Miss Lana Skye. Uh, I hate it. It's flawless, decisive evidence. What? I want. Was, I want to. There was blood found on that shoe. Try Lunchland for all your lunch and decisive evidence needs. Wait. Objection! Witness! What's the meaning of this? Why is this the first time I've heard of this evidence? Simple, as I've already said. I don't trust you with evidence, Mr. Edgeworth. Oh my god, Your Honor. That's why I took the liberty of, of investigating myself. I propose we all have a 3v1 team up against... <laughs> <laughs> I agree. I'll get the shotgun. 3v1 team up? Alright, alright. Let me just... Can I get in on that? Please, cowboy, please, please, stand down. Stand down, partner. I have a knife, you know. Good for you. And you had blood tests performed. Didn't I mention? No! no! I have three boyfriends. <laughs> what? <laughs> what? Oh, Your Honor, oh my Your God. Honor. Your Honor, as I mentioned, STD written. STD. This bitch got more STDs than a fucking plate of STDs. I don't know. In any case, Your Honor, I, ca I can't accept this as evidence. I can't. She, she has more STDs than Quagmire. What? Well, you see, Quagmire is a character on Family Guy that has sex with a lot of people. That's the joke. Also, you must know the two rules of evidence law. Rule number one, 
No evidence shall be shown without the approval of the police department. And your bitch was fired two years ago. So you're not a police force anymore. In other words, this shoe is illegal evidence. At least for the time being. Fuck you. Have a nice day. Is that right, Mr. Wright? Yeah, it seems so. Edgeworth sure is celebrating. <laughs> yeah, honestly, I am too. I'm the best around. No one's ever gonna get me down. Not so fast, Mr. Edgeworth. Oh my god, what? Don't forget, I used to be a detective. Used to? As I mentioned previously, this team has already been tested by a member of the forensics department. As you can see, it was approved by the police department as of today. Oh. Even the general public can produce official evidence, Mr. Edgeworth. <laughs> Is that right, Mr. Wright? It seems so. Edgeworth is looking pretty sullen. I'm going to fucking kill her! You can at least study some Join evidence, Law. Really? The prosecution's complaints now are notwithstanding, I guess. Uh, it appears that this evidence satisfies the first rule of evidence law. However, it seems you have yet another count against you, witness. You've... Really, I'm not going to just ignore that. Anything to ensure that the guilty are properly judged. Well, good for you, sweetheart. All right, Mr. Wright, just just take it down. <sighs> take it downtown. And yeah, you got it. All right, let's do this. Okay, um... Oh, right. One more thing. Wait, is the shoe- wait, is the shoe on the court record? I don't know, is it? Oh, there it is. Yeah, it is. Oh, fun! Okay. Okay. Um... Holy what? shit, Wait a minute! <laughs> Hold it! Oh my god! There's plenty here, too! Well, the soul of the shoe. It's gotta be the victims. He must have stepped in a puddle of his own blood. All this blood, it's horrible. This blood might be uh, an important clue. Interesting. Okay, well. There you go. Okay, well, there's a shoe, so let's look at all those statements real quick. Hmm. Sky, she proves it. Can we present the shoe here since she's talking about the fucking shoe? Yeah, uh, allow me to first make sure that this isn't a stupid idea. Before My ideas are flawless. Fuck you. Watch this. Objection. It's flawed. It's flawed. Your Honor, that statement contradicts this evidence. What? Uh -uh. Oh. Yeah, well, apparently. This evidence. Oh, what? Huh? <laughs> yeah, well, fuck. Yeah, let's just go back. Okay. Anyway, All right. now what? Then maybe press on it? Like, why did, like, all that? I can't let this evidence go through without a fucking fight. I got this Edgeworth. Watch this, baby. What the Ooh, fuck is that? Fish guts, right? Ugh. Ew. That? Something like it hot, Mr. Wright. Yeah. Um, like your client, she's in enough hot water to make a whole vat of soup. Yeah, that's cool, that's right. but I got hot with my husband. Do you or don't you have a problem with the shoe? Why are you asking me like a fucking reporter? God damn it, this is critical. Mr. Ryan, Mr. Ryan, what's the fuck is wrong with this shoe? Is there a problem with the victim's shoe? Of course there's a problem. Oh, it's like a presser. If I'm not imagining things... I'd say there's one critical problem with this evidence. A clear contradiction! Gleam in your eyes. You're still young, rookie. I'll slot the shit out of you. i give you a pepper fish gut now. You couldn't take the heat, could you? Your Honor, hold me back. Get the fucking bailiff. Get the fucking bailiff now. Let's, let's see what Mr. Rat has to say. What is contradictory about the victim's shoot? Show us the problem with this evidence. 
Mm -hmm. we, we might lose our last pit. Uh, yeah, yeah, there it is. There it is. Blood. Blood on the heel. Blood on the heel. Blood right there. You. Show. Present. Take that, bitch. Guess what? I got something to feed you, too. Mm, whatever. Don't respawn. Fuck you. I wonder if there's a. I wonder if you notice there's blood on the bottom of the shoe. Mess with me, Ricky. It will be your blood on the bottom of my shoe. Jesus, just to that kill. was okay. That was an you know what? Okay, that was watch this. I'm about to put my catchphrase to use, real quick. Defendant, you want to try something of mine? Right, right. Please. Indeed. Fucking... There is quite a bit of blood on the bottom of the shoe. I mean, it makes sense. The victim was stabbed with a knife. What could possibly be contradictory about the blood on the bottom of his shoe? Present evidence. Cite your sources. I can't save. Oh boy. Uh... <laughs> um. I should have said it before. Oh, oh, she's wearing heels. She's wearing heels. She's wearing oh, heels. Oh, she's oh. wearing heels. She's wearing heels. The problem lies in the footprint. And I'm about to serve you a real good fucking dish of put proof pudding, pussy. <laughs> <laughs> Note that the bottom of the victim's shoe is covered in blood. Then, isn't it strange? Why weren't why weren't any bloody footprints found by the scene of the crime? Aha! As you can see, there were no traces of any s such footprints at the scene of the crime, and also she's wearing fucking heels. That contradicts your claim about this shoe. OBJECTION! This picture only shows part of the floor, so there could have been bloody footprints! OBJECTION! Then where are they, Mr. Edgeworth? Because... We checked the scene, and we found nothing of the... Order! 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 Tic Tacs! Tic Tacs! Stop with the Tic Tacs. I know they're expired, alright? I'll shit my guts out later, but- WELL WITNESS! <laughs> Yeah, how's that proof pudding pussy taste, bitch? Great going, Mr. Wright, but it's true that the lack of a footprint is a contradiction. But then we have to ask why there wasn't a footprint. No. That's true. There has to be a reason why there wasn't a footprint. Think, Mr. Wright, think! I'm gonna... Mm, I don't know why... I don't know why it's not there. Maybe because it's not her fucking shoe. I'm just good at finding contradictions. What? Uh, hold it! Oh. <laughs> That's my catchphrase. I see. Now I get. No, it's not your catchphrase. It's proof pudding pussy. That's your catchphrase. Mine is stuff like Eureka oh, and Tally Ho. You remembered. I know. I love you. I want you too. Let me get what? <laughs> Our witness what? is more devious than I gave her credit for. Congratulations. I give you pat yourself on the shoulder, witness. We were hoodwinked to the very end, but she slipped. There is one vital hint to the truth in her testimony. But what are you talking about? Think back to when she told us about apprehending the suspect. Listen, I'll do an impression of her voice. The chief prosecutor tried to resist, but her efforts were in vain. She knocked my hands aside, hit over an oil drum. Oh, she's beautiful, but definitely a predator, this one. A leopard woman. Row! And then you do that claw thing that I absolutely hate. I thought that was a strange thing for the normally cool-headed chief to do. I mean, usually she's not cool-headed when she's yelling at me for not doing a case right or whatever, but... I'm regardless. Yeah. No kidding. Now... Witness, allow me to ask a very simple question. This oil drum, was it empty? Oh, that? Hmm. Not sure I like your attitude, Mr. Edgeworth. So apparently you're not the slowest conveyor belt in the lunchbox factory. Witness, what, what, was this oil drum empty or not? The oil drum kicked over by the chief prosecutor was brimming with water. <laughs> water? What does that mean? Still don't get it, Mr. Wright? Do you want no, to know the reason she knocked it over? The real reason? Aha! 
You don't mean? Yes. The suspect knocked over the oil drum for one reason and one reason alone. To erase the bloodstains that would become evidence against her! Warg. Actually, wait real quick. <clears throat> oh, that was really good. Nice job, Mr. Wright. That ties things up you. quite nicely. Put a little bow on it and send over Christmas. The bloodstains left on the victim's shoes tied over quite clearly to this murder. Then after the deed was done, she knocked over the oil drum to erase the telltale signs. Why, that's a prosecutor's specialty. Erasing evidence. Oh, Harvey, ha, ha. <laughs> Edgeworth, I like how you helped her in everything, and now she's just like, haha, fuck you. Yeah, I'm used to it by now. <laughs> that reminds me, Miss Sky, Miss Sky's right hand was hurt. Didn't she say she cut herself when she stabbed him? So that's when my sister Blood got on the shoe? Well, I see no reason to prolong this trial. Mr. Wright, do something, please! What? What can I do? Your sister has confessed to the crime and she's tried to conceal it. But... Enough. There is no need for further debate. The verdict, your honor. Very well. But Angel Star is on the prosecution's side! She could have been lying about the water! This court finds the defendant, Miss Lana Sky. I'm gonna say it. I'm gonna say a uh, god. Oh, wait! Oh, was that me? Little girl. What did you just say? Huh? But me? Did you say that I. Angel Star is on the prosecution side. Well, I mean, yeah, you are. You're saying my sister hid evidence by erasing the bloody footprints. Well, I thought you had your fill, but here you are demanding a second helping. Another lunchbox. A lunchbox called Evan. God damn it! Oh my god. Don't tell me you have something else. OBJECTION! Oh my god! Oh my god! This is- This is highly illegal! The time for deliberations is past! Uh, uh, Edward, I have a question. Yes, what? How come all your- How come all your witnesses kind of just love to fuck the shit out of themselves when they're in court? I don't know! Any further comments and you will be held in contempt of court! Your threats don't scare the cough up, Queen. Oh, oh, they don't scare you, do they? <laughs> <laughs> oh, another photograph. I see. Oh my god. I had it just in case anyone had the gall to suggest. Oh my. That the white shoe didn't belong to the victim. I see no room for error in this evidence. Oh. <laughs> Mr. Wright, wait! Look at the asphalt in this photo! Hey! It's clearly wet. Wet like this pussy. Oh, oh, whatever. Erasing the last trace. You're, wait, you're on the wall. What the fuck was that? <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> what the fuck was that trend? <laughs> immediately after the murder, the crime scene was washed with water. I don't Your Honor, even do you want to talk about it? I don't want to talk about it. I'm sorry, Mr. Wright. I guess I, I couldn't help after all. It's not your fault. I knew we couldn't win this case from the beginning. But it seems that this is what your sister wanted anyway. I'm sorry, Mia. Wait, uh... <laughs> Mia's, Mia's VA right. right or not? Don't be so quick to throw in the towel. Get yourself off the asphalt. Take another good look. Don't give up. Not until the bitter end. Woo! You're the last oh. help, everyone. Spirit medium. It's the last piece of evidence. Very well. This time I'd like to declare a verdict for good. Please. Please. Your Honor. Come on! Objection! Please! 
You gotta wait just one more minute. What? What is it with you people? Can't I just write down my verdicts in peace anymore? Okay, whatever it is, can't it wait? I'm sorry. Go ahead. Pam? Oh boy, hang on. That might be on my end, actually. Hold on, folks. One second. No, I don't want to open that. Uh, I'll be right back, guys. I think my... Uh, okay, what? here it is. Here it is. Sorry about that. Apparently my Discord decided to fuck itself. Okay, okay. Carry on. Carry on. Okay, but uh, no, it can't. Otherwise, it'll be too late. Okay. Recompose myself. <clears throat> Look at this photograph, the last one submitted. This trial isn't over until we re until we give each piece of evidence proper consideration. So right. Are you saying there's a problem with this latest piece of evidence? I mean, yeah. Look at the fucking muffler. I mean, yeah. Yeah, there's a problem. Right or wrong, I've got to go ahead with this. I suppose since we've come this far, we should give every claim a fair shake. Very well, Mr. Wright. Show the core of the problem in this photograph. There was a fucking thing in the muffler down there, what the fuck? The muffler! Oh, yeah, take that! The problem in this photograph is here. What's this? There's something poking out of the car's muffler! Wait just a moment, Mr. Edgeworth! Your Honor, you just said muffler. Oh, but I see no trace of a muffler or scarf of any kind in this photograph. <laughs> uh, oh my god. Your Honor, Your Honor, Your Honor, the car. A muffler is also god. a part of a car. He's a fucking idiot. A, a muffler is also a part of a car, a motorcycle, Your Honor. Does Was there a knife guys... in there? Oh my... Is that your only character bit? Okay. Just think I like guys... my knife, okay? I like my knife. Good for you, Rango. Now, anyway, just think of it as part of the exhaust system. Or a pipe. I see. A and I, I see. Okay. All right. What's that suspicious-looking cloth sticking out of the car's muffler? So what if there is something sticking out of the muffler? <clears throat> what does that have to do with this case? Nothing. Absolutely nothing. Objection! Sorry, Miss Star, but it's not going to be that easy. In fact, you've already told us why this is important to the case. You said as much in your testimony. What? Let's hear what Mr. Wright has on his mind. Tell us, why do you think this piece of cloth and muffler is related to this case? Oh, maybe because you fucking told us about it, uh? Mm -hmm, bitch. Alright, uh... Ah, fuck. Oh, it's the phone call, right? Oh, yeah. Ah, take that. Uh, Miss Star. Recall your testimony for the court? Ah, oh, oh, yes. But, 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 but the muffler. The muffler. The muffler. Uh oh. Muffler. <laughs> <laughs> Could it be that the muffler you heard mentioned was actually this exhaust pipe? If so, that means this piece of cloth is vital evidence. Hey, no one screams in court like that, like what the fuck? They do in oh, Phoenix Wright. Only Phoenix Wright. Well, it seems we will have to su suspend the proceedings. <laughs> That's all I have to say. Yes, we get it. It's the funny sus word. I find myself wondering about that piece of cloth. If you leave any question unanswered here, we do a disservice to the law. Have the car at the crime scene expected at once, and bring me that cloth. The verdict will wait until after we've seen all the evidence. Agreed? Yeah, sure. Uh, I suppose so. Whew. That was close. But, uh, we made it. At least for now. 
This court will adjourn for a 30 minute recess. It's lunchtime after all. <laughs> He's still on. Well, I guess it's Phoenix, right? I haven't voiced anybody. Oh, that's Crow's other fight. account. Gosh darn it, Crow. All right, you know what? Yeah, Crow, what? Why don't, why don't you take. You know what? Okay, Crow, how about. Okay, I got an idea. So let, let's let's split this up. How about Jinx? You can take um Phoenix. Crow, you can take Emma. I hate I, Emma. I, 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 and, I, and I hate Larry, but I voice him anyway. Look, this is about, just, all right. Okay, are you, are we good? Are we ready? Wait, ready? hold on. What if what if Cam comes back? I lose my privileges. What do I do then? Voice the normal stop, characters. Stop asking questions and just read the damn dialogue. Ah, uh, damn. Fine. Um, that's right. Huh? What? Are trials always like this with you? Like, you're swimming up from the bottom of a lake about to reach the surface, but no matter how hard you paddle, you never seem to get there. That's damn. dark. Holy shit. Pretty much. Yeah, like, Pretty <laughs> much. <Jeez. laughs> <laughs> Except today, we're swimming in quicksand. Wow. <laughs> so wow. What happened to your sister anyway? Because I'm fucking nosy, you know? Uh, apparently she got called up to the judges' chambers. The fuck does that mean? Hmm. Probably something to do with that piece of cloth. So, this is where we turn this trial around, right? Our only weapon, a tiny, insignificant piece of cloth. I'm the one who's starting to feel tiny and insignificant, to tell you the truth. Wow, that's crazy. Oh, no. <laughs> oh, no. Who's this? Oh, I think I know who's this. <laughs> Alright. Oh, why do I have to say that? Okay. Um. <laughs> Read the whole line already! Uh, hold on. Partner. I love him. I love him. Oh, boy. So much. They say you show a red cloth to a bull, it'll fire up its temper. That's what they told me when I was a young one, at least. He's so hot! He's <laughs> so hot! Thought I'd come take a look and see my knife and how this child's going. <laughs> Looks like I'm late. They've got the home ranch locked down tight in a fort in Eminem territory. I just called it Eminem, I'm stupid. That <laughs> That heart, oh, that's Phoenix. Yeah, that's Phoenix. That's, that's Look at my knife. That heart to slip out, huh? What is going on over there, anyway? And why do you have a knife? We're we're in a fucking public government building. All the police I've seen these last two days have been really on edge. Don't you got enough on your plate without worrying about other people, compadre? Y you could be worrying about the chief prosecutor's taste in mufflers, for example. Um... Officer Marshall? The whole muffler thing didn't have anything to do with scarves. Fucking idiot. She wasn't even wearing a scarf. Look at my alcohol. <laughs> I stir it with my knife. You don't say. <laughs> now don't that just beat all. <laughs> I've seen the red breeze blow at her slender neck <laughs> Wow. <laughs> I saw it that day too. She was wearing a red muffler. What? Wow. At the award ceremony that afternoon, Edgeworth seen it too, I'd reckon. What does that mean? What the fuck it is means this I, you're talking about? It means, I, it means I have a knife. In the photograph taken at the crime scene, she wasn't wearing a scarf. Wow. Well, she was there, fuckhead. <laughs> So, this time wasn't mistaken. Well, it's about time. It's about driving. It's about Remember, partner, I got a knife. And sometimes you gotta <laughs> crack the bull by the way. <laughs> and sometimes you just gotta let that bull go where it will. Time will tell. I have a bad feeling about this. Jeez. I have a bad so... feeling about this knife. Oh my fucking god, shut up about the fucking So what are these women? Shit! If it's steak sauce, I can hook you up with some fine ribs. I have a good knife to cut them with. Wait! <laughs> oh wait! <laughs> oh wait! <laughs>
<laughs> right. hates us right now. Cowboy. I, I, mean, I wanted to voice the character. Well, <laughs> all right, all right. I'd like to resume. My knife is better than you. For the prosecution. Right, Reggie. Oh my god! You <laughs> like that? You Is something wrong, Miss? Is something wrong, Mr. Edgeworth? Your face is blue, your lips are purple, you're sweating bullets, your uh, hands are sweaty arms, spaghetti. That furrowed <laughs> brow, those grindy teeth, those watery eyes, that luscious locks, that very fine cravat. What's that more? Very nice. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. What's more? You but, uh, it can't be. This can't happen. Yes, it can. Wow, I wonder why this guy your boyfriend is <laughs> so worked up, Phoenix. God damn. He stole my knife and I punched him in the face. <laughs> well, <laughs> well then, I believe it is time we continued on with this trial. During our recess, I had requested that the prosecution conduct an investigation. This is unacceptable! Well, I mean, hmm. It seems our, it seems our prosecutor is quite beside himself. Uh, excuse me, knock knock? What? Huh? Who's there? Uh, is it? <laughs> Your mom. <laughs> oh! oh the fuck is this guy? There he is. <laughs> this guy. All right. I'm wondering. <laughs> All right. Why is Crow having a panic attack? What? The R seems to be still in the courtroom. Who is this motherfucker in his weird ass, fucking mm -hmm. disgusting mm -hmm. ass color palette? Hey, the temperature rose five point seven degrees with a nightgown. What? <laughs> what the fuck? Who is this guy? <laughs> Why does he look like he has dude? boobs? He's my favorite. I love him. Dude, right. what is up with his fucking color palette? It's so bad. Alright. Um, ah, it's you. <laughs> is he mute? <laughs> wait, wait, wait! Come on, look at him. He's just, <laughs> he's just <laughs> staring. <laughs> All right. Oh, oh. <laughs> All right. Sorry I'm late, Aji. The roads were packed. It's just me. Long time no see, eh, Aji? How you been? Swim much these days? Ah, uh, hello, hello. No, no, I've been so busy. Busy, busy, smizzy, Aji, my boy. You have to make time to relax. Yes, indeed. Aji. Seems to be his nickname for the judge. Yeah, I'm yeah, so fucking no cool. Shit. Yeah, I'm so fucking cool. I'm right. very afraid. Um, sorry, but who are you exactly? Ha! <laughs> so you're Rido, the attorney. I've heard good things about you, son. Uh, uh, thanks. So sorry about our little worthy giving you all that trouble, eh? You know, we should all go swimming together sometime. Jolly! That sounds good. Can I bang my mouth? <laughs> Mr. Rat! Oh, okay. You don't- You don't know the district chief of police? That's the district chief of police? Really? Really? He's the chief of police? He's the top ranking police officer in the entire district! Okay, wait, but like, look at his stupid ass smile. <laughs> <laughs> Alright. Name's Gant. Damon Gant. Pleased to meet everyone. It's the Gant. So, Gant. <laughs> uh, so, so what, what do we owe this honor today? It's been over two years since you last came to this courtroom, hasn't it? Well, it's worthy here. Look at the poor fella. I just thought I'd help out by bringing this. Hey, that's my sister's mother. Wow, I'm so cool and smart, oh, and I can see just mm, Thanks. When the crime occurred, this guy really was that muffler. Why is he called a muffler? But to think that it was stuffed into that exhaust pipe on Little Worthy's car, no less. <laughs> Little Worthy. <laughs> His stupid ass smile makes me want to. It's really so quite. Annoying. It's really quite embarrassing, even for us. Well, what's this? It's what you call a switchblade knife. Quite perplexing, this. That's a good knife. Objection! <laughs> Chief! What kind of outfit are you running? 
That's Mr. what I'm wondering. Mr. Edgeworth, how could they miss such a vital piece of evidence? If your investigations are this lax, how do you expect us to do our job? Now, wait a minute, Worthy. I have no desire to hear your excuse. I'm telling you to wait. Or didn't you hear me? Oh, fuck. <laughs> I like him. I like him. Have, have, a look at, have a look at this document where it's... Okay. Oh, I don't like it. Cool. I have a look at this document where it says person in charge of investigation. There's no mistake in that signature, is there? Miles Edgeworth. Th that that's not fair! On the day of the crime, I I had your head in the clouds because you got that award, I know how you feel. But you're the person in charge. I'll expect a written apology. What? <laughs> Get Are fucked, you... Edgeworth. Are you serious? <laughs> Don't be too upset, we'll find a way to clean up this mess that you made. <laughs> like Gatekeep Girl Boss? This is the first time I've seen Mr. Andrew at a loss for words. Why do you sound like Maya? This kind of This kind of major blunder is unlike you, Mr. Edgeworth. You're really just gaslighting Edgeworth right now. The court accepts this new evidence. But I'd like to ask the defense a favor first. Yes. Just to be sure, I'd like to take a look at the blade of this knife. The blade of it? Well, I don't see why not. Why can't I look at it first? Could you open it up for me, I wonder? Yeah, well, I think all you have to do is push that switch and... If I cut my finger, Mr. Wright, I won't be able to pound my gavel anymore. <laughs> yeah, but if I cut my finger, I won't be able to point it at people anymore. <laughs> <laughs> That's one of the best Just lines in this game. Christ, y'all are such a pussy. That is the best line I've heard so far. Why is Edgeworth's knife covered in blood? I missed a lot. I wasn't here. Because he... Because it was used to kill someone. Oh, right. that's fun. So you just <laughs> get this little bit here, and... Whoop. Whoa! It's broken off. <laughs> oh, and no. it has blood I mean, on it. It's broken. The knife's broken! Oh no! My switch blade! It's broken! <laughs> it's broken! Don't scare me like that! A, a perfectly good <laughs> knife, wasted. <laughs> Alright. Give me a second, I gotta turn the volume on the TV down, so I'm picking up on the mic. You're starting okay. to sound like this, my stepbrother. <laughs> I'm the one who's scared. Look at that knife blade. <laughs> <laughs> knife <laughs> blade. Knife <laughs> blade. Oh, that's the tip. It's broken. It's broken. Stained blood. Blood. Yes, it is. Dracula's so shaking blood. in his boots. All right. This does not excuse the actions of the police department. I would like to hear an explanation from the chief of police himself. I'm terribly sorry, but could I ask you to just testify for us about the slip no. between the prosecutors and the defense and the police, or in this knife? Sure, sure thing. Not knife. a problem. Not even a little one, really. I want that knife. I fucking hate this dude. And his stupid what? ass smile. That's like the old white dad smile. I hate it. Alright. This knife is nice special. Alright, this knife is special, but I can't say how here. Unless okay. there's evidence to prove a connection between this knife and Goodman. That was a bad day for the department. We weren't in any shape to do an investigation. A detective was killed at the police department, see? What a mess. The time of the crime? 5.15. Scary coincidence, eh? It's not officially linked to this here case, so I can't talk much about it. Oh, uh, there, there was a murder at the police department? A detective? That's hush hush information, Uji. We haven't exactly announced it yet. Objection! Objection! Yeah, the entire fucking court. 
Wait a second! You said 5.15. That's the exact time that Detective Goodman was killed at the prosecutor's office! Bro, what? That means there's a link between the two. Order! 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 Shut the fuck up! No. Anyway, we yeah. the... Anyway, with the department, we're all flustered, as you might well assume. We're in the middle of a top or top top secret investigation. Don't tell anyone, okay? Well, I, think we told anyone. Don't tell anyone. I think we understand the police department's situation. Well, Mr. Rat. Two detectives killed at the same time, two different places. The chances of that are really slim. Scientific. Science! <laughs> Science! Scientifically speaking, of course. I fucking hate my job. I'd like to exercise my right to cross examine the witness. Please. Very well. However, keep your uh, questions focused on the case at hand. Yes, sir. Alright, uh, who, who here that's not played the Phoenix Wright games would like to, uh, play the game okay so i'll i'll, I'll take scared. it I, i'll I take it i don't quite right. understand the, the whole right, thing you're you're All the right. uh you're the interim ham what do you want to do okay uh next one next one <laughs> press something happened at the police Department two, huh? Uh, hang on, time out. Uh, you have to say all the uh, the pop lines like. Hold oh, it! Why? <laughs> because okay. it's the rules. Oh, right. You want to be Phoenix yeah. right? You gotta follow them. <laughs> Stop yelling at me! You can I mean, talk like a normal fucking human being, please. Trent, you don't right. have to flex, but you can yell at your house. Yeah, well, I mean, just anyway, continue. Yeah, continue, Trent. I already read the line when you so rudely interrupted me. Okay, if you want to be sassy, I can, I can go ahead and just take these <laughs> off your hands. <laughs> sassy is my middle name. Thank you. You got a good look in your eyes I there. Wish. Right up. You got a good... You got a good <laughs> look at... <laughs> How many times do I have to fucking say... All right. You got a good look in your eyes. Hey, hey, Phoenix writes back. Phoenix. No! Okay, Thank okay. Christ! Okay. Fucking yelling at me. Hey, Thanks, Ham. Sam. Yeah. Sam, hey. yeah. we met my favorite. We met my favorite member. Now the natural order can be restored. So, Ham, basically this guy came in and said that there has been a murder at the police department. Essentially. Also, Edgeworth yeah. might be going to timeout. Trent kept yelling at me because I'm not being good enough as Phoenix Wright, apparently. Oh, my. Okay. Ham. Ham hasn't talked yet. Ham. <laughs> yeah. Ham. He, it takes him a while. Ham. Give him a second. All right. I'll, I'll just go ahead and read the line. Uh, you got a good look in your eyes there, right, oh my boy? Sharp, hungry. So something did happen, and why wasn't I informed? Why weren't you informed? Well, why didn't you ask? What the <laughs> fuck does that mean? <laughs> No matter, I understand. You were busy, well, with Lana's case and all. Well, what happened? What happened at the police department that day? Um. Next. Next. Actually, wait. Back four times. Uh, forward once, and then press. Hold it! Yeah. What happened to the police department? We already did this! Yeah. Oh, wait, did yeah. I? We, yeah, we already did this. Oh, I'm an idiot. Okay. <laughs> Bruh. <laughs> Good job, Jing. Okay, uh, go back. That's the same one we just did. Yeah, no. Exactly. This one. You mean... Go back again. Forward. So what we're trying to find is what happened at the police department that day. Okay, so forward. I mean, we know what happened. Somebody got forward. Murdered. Forward. That's what we're trying to find out. 
That one. <laughs> what is it? it? On the same oh, okay, day, the detective was killed in the prosecutor's parking lot. Another detective was killed at the police department? That's a fact. Surprising, isn't it, Uji? I'm at a loss for words. Yeah, why are you laughing at that? That's kind of fucked up. There's I'm definitely got to be two <laughs> separate murderers, I'm, right? I'm at a loss for words. And the perpetrator? Do you have a suspect? Well, there was a suspect. Just arrested him, in fact. Just arrested? That was quick. Oddly but so. There's still a lot of unanswered questions. Maybe you could help, Rhino. I suppose I could help. Can you help me by giving me date on your case? Ooh, good one. This kid's sharp. Okay, here's the deal. I'll tell you one thing and one thing only. Ooh. Oh. Oh. Was found. How the victim was killed. When the victim died. What do you want to know? We know when the victim died. He said five. Yeah, we, we, yeah, we know when it died. So how the victim was killed? We no. don't know that. No, it was probably the, the broken switchblade knife, was it not? Well, then, okay, yeah. If assuming it was Where? a switchblade knife, then the only thing that if we, we don't yeah, know... if so, if we we have the picture evidence of the of Edgeworth's knife being used to kill the first guy. We know, we know, we know now that the switchblade knife is what killed the second person, and we know when he died, which is the exact same time. So do where? But I thought right. we already knew where the victim was found, unless this means like exactly. Where. So tell me, where was the victim found? I don't like those three dots. I don't like <laughs> it too much. Well, okay, I, good. I, I can't. You I literally can't speak. just said you would answer my question. I can't speak on where the corpse was found. But I can say the crime took place in the evidence room at the police department. Hmm. That's, that's suspicious. You wouldn't know about the evidence room, would you, Rhino? I've been. I can't say I've heard of it. Bro, you've been there. I guess I should ask again once I learn a bit more about this evidence room. There's something stranger about this than the place where the body was found. What was the last line he said? Uh, there's there's, there's a... another scary coincidence about this uh, crime. Well, no, I know I, I know I know that. But... The next one after him. No, I mean like the one he just said, like the uh -huh. one he said right before he went to this. What did he say? Not not in he... this, but when he said earlier he when he said was actually that, talking. Uh, that's not the only like suspicious thing about. What we just said. I had to remember, it, and then you asked the okay. question and tried yeah, to then do, then do, like... then do then do then do the time of the crime. All right. Yeah, press here. Hold it. Five, five fifteen. But, but that's that's when Detective Goodwin was killed in the prosecutor's office. What? Funny, isn't it? A murder at the prosecutor's place and a murder at our place at the very same time. What are the chances? Bro. Bro. Coincidence? I think not. This is just a good feeling, but I see there's a 0.001% chance of that happening. No, shut up. <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna make it sound more annoying. Please tell us more about the incident. Go back. So we've done that one, go back. We've done that one, go back. We've done that one, go back. For this Go. One. Yeah, press. Press for that one. Hold it! This knife was found on the scene of our crime. That makes it connected to the case, don't you? Nah. See, there's a lot of things that go on in the department I can't explain. It's delicate, okay? Sorry, Rhino. Oh, uh, I said to give him a second. Wait! 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 That is an evidence tag on that knife. It's an evidence tag. Maybe there's something about the knife that will give us a clue. Let's examine that if we can, right? Oh my I god. You. <laughs> I hate you. I hate you. I hate you. <laughs> that leads this knife to Detective Goodman. I think perhaps the pieces are falling into place. I should try presenting the piece of evidence that's had me stumped all this time. Which is... So, how are things down at the department? 
Fucking horrible. Well, so obviously I think we know it's definitely this statement here, but what is it you want to present? I don't know. I have not the very. The oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I mean, we're gonna have to uh, 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 examine the knife, right? Yeah. I don't do that. Django, you know what you should say? What? Examine the tag. Yeah, the tag. It's a funny thing. It's a funny thing. Hey, we're examining the knife. <laughs> it's a nice knife we're examining. Can I look? Ooh, look at that. I can zoom out. That's a, that's a knife. That's a Hello knife. there. Hey, zoom in, zoom in right. farther. I want to examine the knife. This is as far as I can zoom in. The, ma the majestic right. knife. It's a majestic knife. It's all on the knife. It says SL92. What's that supposed to mean? I'm not sure, but it reminds me of a similar code. DL6. Maybe it's a case number? No, it's definitely a case number. That's weird. <laughs> what? <laughs> I don't remember where. <laughs> 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 I don't have Cam's microphone. <laughs> oh. <clears throat> but I think I've seen something like this before. Couldn't have said that something earlier. Similar to, something similar to what's written on this tag. It wasn't that long ago either. Maybe we're cool glasses. Maybe I should check the court record again. Yes, sir. Alright. Well, we've examined everything on that, so... Uh, well, I'm back in consciousness. What's happening, huh? Yeah! <laughs> We regained oh, the OG about Phoenix. Time. All about right, Phoenix. Time. So oh, what happened? Wait, wait, right. wait, wait. What's going? Wait, why are we in court resume? Right, right. Okay, so listen. This big scary man. Actually, what in. the fuck? Listen to me. <laughs> this this big scary orange man came in. He's kind of my boss, but not really. Um, we're trying to figure out what why the murder at the police department's linked to the murder we're doing right now. Okay, okay. Speaking on the evidence, so I can see the man who is. You are choppy as fuck. We found evidence. Oh yeah, you're really dying. choppy right now. I'm gonna die. Uh... My Phoenix rape privilege is back. Alright, alright. Okay, 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 real quick. So this is the knife, right? This bring the bring down the- WHO THE FUCK- Oh, that's, that's, that's Mr. Gant. That's Mr. Gant. He's my favorite character. Yeah, so this is the- this is the knife okay, that Mr. Gant brought in. Yeah. It's a switchblade knife, specifically. Okay, well, I can see that because of the switch on the side. And it is yeah. broken and has blood on the end. Yeah, so we're trying, to figure... we're trying to figure out a way it's linked to our current crime. And the only clue we have is this. It told us to check the court record. And we're checking the court yeah, we have record. To check the court record. So, what do you want to present? Who the fuck is that big bastard? He's my favorite character. He's the chief of police. Now, are we caught up? Now, good. What do you want to present? He looks like Hellcake. <laughs> um, <laughs> uh, uh, who was one of my? Which one of my personalities was in control while I was asleep? Which one of yours? Somebody okay. or other. Cool. What evidence? Was it you? No. Well, yeah, it was me. Sorry. Okay, which, what do you want me to present? You were in control, you have more memory in this case, uh, what, what happened? Jenga was in control, I don't know what's going on. All right, you I know was Jenga... actually in control at that point. You know what, Jenga, as your- as Jenga, your... what was you? As your okay, swan so song- As your swan song, just, what, what do you want to present? Um... Hang on, keep going. No, no, not that way, the other way. Cut my life into pieces. This is my pudding cup. <laughs> <laughs> well, I mean, it's obvious. <sighs> Wait, hold on. It's either the note. I'm sorry, Sam, you're dying. Wait, is it the note? Is it the note? Oh. Do I present the note? It was S92, right? Uh, SL9. 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 Wait, it says SL92, and there's a 2 in that note. There's also a 2, and flipping, and 
And technically, 6 minus 75 is negative 9. <laughs> is oh it? my... Do you want to present yeah. the note or not? <laughs> <laughs> uh, let's try it. Let's try it. Okay. All right. Am you ready? You ready to take over as Phoenix runs yeah, again? I am. You ready? You ready to run again? Okay. okay. Yeah. I'm. All right, I'm go ahead. Uh, I think I'm. All right. Ready. Ready. Okay. I think you. Okay. I, I think you know what to. I think you know what to say. Let me. Let me. Uh, <coughs> <laughs> <laughs> you must have shut out. <laughs> That was great. L, it happened. It's like oh my god. This is actually That's really cool. funny. This is pretty oh, funny. Man. Do I have to say it again? Uh, no, just go ahead and read. Go ahead, go ahead, go ahead. Okay, wait a second. Back in control, I can think now. Ah, at last, an honest to good objection. Oh, you sound actually like a sweet old man. I actually feel bad for actually Chris. He's a nice, ugly dad smile. No! You'll see what I mean. He has a beautiful smile. He has a beautiful smile. Alright, uh, this knife. This has to have something to do with Detective Goodman. What do you mean? Aha! And honest to goodness, what do you mean, Fromudgy? This is great. Oh my god. <laughs> I like this guy. He's pretty cool. Edgeworth, he's pretty cool, right? He does have a pretty cool knife. I fucking hate you. <laughs> what? What? I, wait, I... <laughs> the <laughs> personality's <laughs> fucking me over with Edgeworth. What the hell? Okay, it was, whatever. It was, it was, it was, knife. Probably, it was probably Robin. It's probably Robin. Robin! <laughs> I, I did not do anything. It reads <laughs> SL92. And this is important. Why? Oh, over here we also have a memo that was on the body of the victim. Jenga turned upside down. Oh, uh, yeah! Uh, what's this? Oh my, I love how we guessed what it was. Oh, uh, yeah! Alright, six, <laughs> 6 minus 7 S, 12 over 2. Uh, okay, uh, Mr. Rat, I seem to have failed algebra. Can you, can you explain this to me in dumb dumb terms? Sorry. Say that again. Oh, well, you are. It's not math. It's actually upside down. Cause we're all dum dums here. That dunga pussy shape. The printed name on the memo makes it look like it's right side up. But turn it around, and what do you get? Turn them together, and what do you? Get? <gasps> oh! Uh, aha! Well, would you look at that? Would you look at that? Whoever wrote this, whoever wrote this note was holding the paper upside down. Like an S idiot. SL9. That's the same thing as written on the knife's tag. I love how we completely guessed that. <laughs> order, he's, order. So, he's so well postured. Order, order. Well, chief. Mm -hmm. Ah, well. I That's guess the cat. I guess the cat's out of the bag. You win, Rhino. I just, I just woke up. So, well, technically, m myself, I just woke up. I don't know what you're talking about, but I guess I won. I don't know how. What game are we playing, Reg? I, 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 re I really don't know. I was just, I was just doing the evidence part. Yeah. Congrats. Yeah, congrats for right. You won a uh, trip to Vegas. Hope you enjoy it. I'm pretty sure. Oh, really? I'm not right. taking hey, that you're, you're in charge now. You do the, yeah. you do the evidence. The knife was evidence in a case. It was stolen from the department's evidence room. Oh, is this the whole testimony or is that the new one? I think yeah, this is a new line. This is a new line. Press. Let's continue to the next thing. Oh yeah, you can hold it. So this <laughs> knife was stolen. Yes, but on the day of the murder, it was evidence. You say. Was it in fact a murder weapon? Nice, nice, nice! Good show, little worthy! It was a murder weapon, as it happens. It was evidence from a case long since solved. His attitude just makes me think of Samuel. <laughs> so this knife was stolen on the day of the murder. And it was found in the exhaust pipe of Edgeworth's car. Was it wrapped around in a fucking... Napkin or some shit? Why is there? Oh god damn it! Not you. 
I think there isn't a connection there. Oh, now your now your voice. Oh. <laughs> okay. Someone else is in front. <laughs> So, should we press on this statement? Because we didn't really press on it. Yeah, we didn't do that one, so yeah, go ahead. Yeah! I was yawning. Hold it! Don't yawn. How can- Wow, rude. How can you say there's no connection? Hell? Because I'm the chief of police! I can't just say anything <laughs> I please, right -o, You understand? Try to understand, right -o. Well, if he could prove there is a connection, more power to you. Maybe there is something that ties the two murders together. I mean, the fact that they happened at the same time. Why is everyone calling you Rido? What is that? How much did I miss? Whatever. The, whatever this, guy has, this guy has a song nickname for everyone, him. He has nicknames for everyone. Oh, he does? Yeah, for some Hey, yo, Judge, what's your does. nickname from him? Uji. Yeah, Uji. Aww. Uji. That's yeah, nice. That's <laughs> like that. Yeah. Yeah. Does Emma get a nickname? Emma doesn't deserve a nickname. No. no, no. Two detectives were killed at 5:15. The prosecutor's office. Hmm. I wanted the police department. That can't be a coincidence. And that <laughs> What the fuck? Happened? Why? Did, how much did you chit? You know what? I don't care. Whatever. I better take this knife out. Essentially, there was two murders. Yeah. All right. Well, speaking, there's nothing to worry about. Um. <laughs> okay. Small tag attached. Should we present Small the knife now? Tag. Because it said. Sorry, sure, I think we should do that. Yeah. Yeah. Well, should be at this statement though, because I think it should be oh, like right. Wow. Here and then we can present the knife, right? Because it says that it was found in the defendant's no. muffler. Oh uh, yeah, right? sure. Yeah, yeah just saying. Uh, yeah. Okay, uh, 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 um, objection! Wait, what? What? What the fuck? What that was? What that was Your the Honor? answer? Oh, you honor this shit bowl. Okay. Well. Oh well, fuck. Gotta love Ace Attorney, man. Okay. Well then, just I guess you can think about it. Real quick, while I look up the actual answer, because I got. <laughs> can I present the? Can I present the knife at the first thing? Okay. I mean, I have the health bar to do it, so I might as well just have one more oopsie just in case to see. Objection. Yeah. Your honor, contradiction. <laughs> oh, well, uh, well, Mr. Rat, no contradiction. Fuck you. <laughs> This is why you got Tic Tacs yesterday and not Skittles. Ooh. Well, I will have you know that those Tic Tacs were delicious. They were expired. That's why your mom buys you Mega Bloss instead of Legos. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's why your mom buys you Mega Bloss instead of Legos. So wait, is it canon that freaking Phoenix Wright has DID now? I mean... Did, all of us talking normally is just all different versions. <laughs> oh no. Our, uh, us talking like as ourselves is just us in the stands watching this bullshit happen and commentating exactly. over all of it. And then exactly. Jake Marshall with, with the Okay, apparently we have to press the fifth Marsh stick. Did someone say I Marshall? One, two, three, four, five. I, dude, I hate when freaking Phoenix Wright games is like, you have to press this statement again after you did this thing. Okay, that's definitely something you'll figure out by yourself. Yeah, no connection. Okay. Uh, 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 uh. Wait, wait, no, the other was fucking. The one before this? So. We already pressed this one. This one is right. Fifteen. Hold it. What are the odds? Press everything. Uh, it just. All right. I get. I Hold it. it. I the uh, same day he killed people. <laughs> uh, I don't know what's happening. Okay, maybe. We, maybe we... Shit going okay, so fucking... maybe, um, maybe we I have don't to do know. this one we didn't. 
Maybe we have to do this one, how the victim was killed, because you probably don't actually know. How was murdered happened? <laughs> I'm sorry, I'm very out of it. I, I know that you've already talked to me, but I was not conscious during this all. I'm sorry, Mr. Gant. Okay, no problem. How was he killed? Now that's the interesting part. It was what we found in the was what we in the force call a stabbing. With uh, <laughs> stabbing. With uh, are you, are you listening to this part, Marshall? With a knife. A knife. Yeah. <laughs> I like, I like knife. this guy. Hey, Edward, I found you a new dad. Yeah, I love this freaking Marshall. I love this guy. We used to watch the Rango movies yeah. together. Oh, yeah, he was, he has a lot of knives in it. Oh yeah, <laughs> we we put on now, a pretty split film. Oh yeah. How long has he had this obsession with um, like, knives? By the way, Mr. I Gant. Like, I like to oh. think that Marshall is neurodivergent, and his hyperfixation is knife. <laughs> I'd say oh, about. God, imagine a six-year-old just like naff. Yeah, he's he's, <laughs> he's been with the, he's been in the knife business since he was ten. I almost say ten. It was it was, it was actually non, Mr. Gant. Not that is. That. Uh, that is very concerning. I have, young. I have over a hundred thousand different knives. This is sounding like my stepbrother more and more, and I don't like. It. <laughs> <laughs> my stepbrother has over a hundred knives, ba like basically a hundred knives. I have over a hundred thousand knives. He's a pussy. That's, that's the. <laughs> <laughs> We're never gonna get to this game done. That's exactly no, the. Not. That's ex exactly the same as Detective Goodman. That's oh. the spirit we're cooking now. But you know... Soul food. That's not the only thing that was exactly the same. He has such like a wide, like, resting face. Like, his mouth just goes from one side to the other without stop. I know, I love him. He's my favorite. It's awesome. Alright, uh, what, uh, what exactly do you mean, Mr. Gant? There are more similarities between the two cases of the cause of death. Yeah, it seems like I'm going to have to press this a bit harder. By the way, Mr. Gant, I have a question off topic of the case. Would you be yeah. considering of adopting Edgeworth over there? Because I would really lo like it if you were my father-in-law. Uh, well, I mean, you know, that... Okay, probably, I don't know. Let's go! <laughs> <laughs> I just, I'm, I'm at a complete fucking loss. What the hell am I supposed to do? Okay. Look at the. Okay. By the way, can I say real quick about your tweet with the marshal as the Joker, like Jared Leto? Can I mention there's also a various amount of grenades and pistols in the photo with also knives? <laughs> like, you know, like, ah, here's my math collection, here's my grenade collection, here's my assortment of various raffles and guns. I also, I also have a rocket launcher, but don't tell anybody that. <laughs> I found that funny. It's, it's my special secret weapon. Out. What do the hell does this fucking game want me to do? <laughs> yeah, okay. I, I, here, no, try it. How about I do it? How about I try? D fucking good luck, because I'm stumped for once, and I'm usually never with this shit. <laughs> Did we have you to look up the answers? I think you're I am look. I am looking up the answer. It's fuck you, ham. I, but the fucking tutorial is dog <laughs> shit. <laughs> Uh, what okay. day is this? Is this day four? Okay, 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 okay. No, it's like, okay, okay, so... Look through oh, the, the trial record. ladder. Hover, okay, yeah. We we already presented Goodman's note, so we don't have to do that part. Press on that. You thing. ask about the victim's ID number? Yeah, yeah, I'm... Tr no, we didn't. The, no, we I didn't, but... Okay, no, we didn't. I'm trying to find that question, but it's not showing up. I you have, pressed... you, you have to, you have to, um, let's see. Um, da, 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 da. where the victim was. Okay, wait, let's see. Press Grant's fourth statement. Who killed the detective at the police department? Grant will allow you to choose other questions. You have a choice, so pick where the victim was found. Grant can't say, but he what? does tell you the Where did pick that found. option? What the fuck? Oh where my god. Where the victim god. was found? Yes! We already picked it! Felix Wright, what the fuck? Okay. <laughs> where was the victim found? Where was so the victim found? tell me, where found? was the victim found, Mr. Grant? Oh, that's a funny story! He was found in the evidence room! What a quicky dink! The evidence room? The evidence room! Okay. 
happen. Finally! Jesus Christ! Okay, alright, so... I did it. Oh. <laughs> Damn goes, I did it. There's the connection! <laughs> I did that legitimately. Thank you, other personality known as Wikipedia. Yeah! <laughs> you're legitimately! <laughs> something that a normal <laughs> Phoenix Wright player could have figured out all by themselves! Okay, alright, hey, hey, Mr. Judge, I think I know why I'm surviving this long. I have another personality in my head called Wikipedia. W w Wikipedia? <laughs> why right. not? Well, since when did the Wikipedia personality from? <laughs> okay, can we please continue with the game, please? You seem Mr. I wouldn't mean happy, I just woke up. We just, and we just handed our tickets to go down to, to go down on this case. I was look between the two cases established. We finally have leverage. And now we can. Now we just have to ask about the fucking details. <laughs> about the fifth statement. Oh, wait. There it is. Now we can finally press the fifth and final statement. Chief. Allow me to ask you a question I could not before. <laughs> the defense's position is simply this. Yeah, huh? <laughs> the connection between these two cases has already been proven. Heh, <laughs> you don't say! Well, out with it, Rido. What's your connection? Yes, out with it, Mr. Wright. Something you could have fucking said like ten minutes ago, please. Connection is a place mentioned in the testimony we just heard. Uh, the knife found in the lot was stolen from the evidence room. Not to mention the victim had on him the case number on the knife's evidence tag. We also know that the detective murdered at the police department was killed in the very same evidence room as this knife. And Mr. Mr. Ah. Sheriff, yeah, I knew you were gonna say that. I was gonna tell you not to, but I kept the story. <laughs> Indeed, there do seem to be too many connections for it to just be a coincidence. <laughs> that, that, that blank stare with a smile. You two make a good pair. That's why I'm here. Oh. It took me. T it took my men two days to find out what you deduced right here. Chief, I, I like request. Guy, actually, I request that you release your information on the victim at the police department. See, that's the tricky part. It hasn't been announced yet, and all. <laughs> Can we get the wow. information? Um, fingers pushed against each other unofficially. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Try oh. Do that mm, really condescendingly. Yeah. Mm, oh, don't look at me like that. Oh, sure. <laughs> <laughs> Why not? It's it's unofficial after all. We'll, we'll do this off the book. You know, we don't have to tell nobody about it. Isn't this fin isn't this on live television? Wait, really? No. <laughs> you figured it would. Oh, sorry. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, I was doing a big shot. Don't worry about it. Oh my god, stop. <laughs> okay. Now we have a new, new, new statement. Do you want to press the new, new statement? I, I don't know about that. I kind of want to go back and press the fifth statement. No, yes, this one. Press it. <laughs> uh, but hold it. If you're going to tell us a little, why not tell us everything? Ah, uh -huh, well, case information is sticky stuff. You have to do everything properly. Oh, well, I guess I might as well try to get what I can out of him. You know the what? No. ID right? number. Yeah. yeah, no, fuck you. We're just doing the ID number immediately. We gotta get we gotta get going. Okay, how about you tell us about the victim's ID number, Dad? Hmm? Ah, sure, why not? It's not like you'll be able to tell who it is from that or anything like that. <laughs> oh, of course not. You, you won't tell me their name after all. We keep a tight <laughs> lid on ID numbers, so don't go getting your hopes up. The number is... Five eight four two one eight nine. Well, well, that's quite, that's quite long. Yeah, that's what, that's what IDs are. That's what, that's what IDs are, dumbass. And we have to remember that. You just insulted the judge.
Yeah, I'm the chief of police. I don't give a fuck. We have to remember these. It drives me nuts. <laughs> Eight, two. I can't do it. I'm dumb. You don't need. You didn't need to judge say something. Yeah. Uh, uh, well, you Mr. Rat. Didn't even get the first numbers right. Okay. Thanks for that. Put down. Does this tell you anything? The ID number of the victim of the police department. Five eight four two one eight nine. It tells me something. <laughs> I wonder what it could be. Actually, it does, Your Honor. It does. I think. <laughs> Meaning. <laughs> hmm, Stidoff. It has to be what I think it is. But what does this mean as the camera gets closer to my face? Well, let's hear what the defense has to say. You say the ID number of the detective who was murdered at the police department <laughs> tells you something. What does it tell you? Wow. Oh, I have a, I have a, I have an ID on me that reads five eight four two one eight nine, which is coincidentally <laughs> take that witness. <laughs> what is it, Mister Wright? You're grinning like a schoolgirl on prom night. Did Edgeworth like? That's a saying. Did, yeah, that's a saying. Really? Did Edgeworth, wow. did Edgeworth pop the question already? <laughs> of marriage? That's a thing for a while. Yeah, I don't know how you not heard about it. We invite. We gave you an invitation. Really? I I, I looked my th mail recently. I probably lost it. Oh, okay. Well, no, no, I just got confused. And this is news. <laughs> <laughs> Asshole. Just come out with both guns blazing, like you always do. Yeah, you oh. know too much about that. <laughs> the police department. The prosecutor's office. Two places, two detectives murdered at one time. Actually, I had, I happen to have a, a, a police ID here. Oh, -ho! is it yours? Oh, no, I wish. I'm a defense attorney, remember? Mm, this is the ID number of our victim, Detective Goodman. Shame on you, Rhino. Personal IDs are top secret. Yeah, well, this is court. Sorry, Dad. Whatever. Detective Goodman's ID number is 5842189. Like, and well, fuck. This this means what exactly? Well, uh, excuse me. Wait, that ID number we heard from the chief earlier. That started with eight two. Hmm, I I forgot. He <laughs> didn't even remember the first number again, bro. Whatever. The number the chief of police gave us was eight four two. It was the exact same. <laughs> Objection. Wait a second, right? What is this? Yell it up. Uh huh. Mean? I think I know what you. I think you know what I mean. The two ID numbers are exactly identical. In other words, the detective killed in the police department's evidence room was Bruce Goodman. What does our wit witness think about that? <laughs> Sharp as attack, Rhino! Sharp as attack! But, but, but wait! Detective Goodman is our victim! He was killed at 515 in the underground parking lot! Yeah, and Detective Bruce Goodman was also killed at the police department. In the evidence room at the exact same time. What's Objection! Th th that's impossible! So what we're saying is... The Real same quick, Edgeworth. What? We live in a world with psychics. You really think this shit's impossible? I have no idea what you're talking about. The same person was killed at the same time? And in a completely different location? Was it a clone? <laughs> order! Or order! Order! Alright, I'm taking away your phone. How many numbers no. has he got? No, 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 no. What I want to know is, why didn't I hear about this? I already had to deal with... 
fuck off. I had to deal with all that fucking <laughs> bullshit with the lunch lady. Like, okay. Yes, it's top secret. Fine. Wait, there's a lunch but, lady? But I'm the oh. prosecutor. Yes, that one from fucking ten minutes ago. But I'm the prosecutor in charge of this case. Now, just wait a second, Worthy. No need to get all flustered. Your Honor, the police department has made a grave error in this case. Wait. Oh, God. I said wait. Or didn't you hear me? He's <laughs> I love him. The oversight? The grave error? Mr. Edgeworth, they're yours. Wh wh what? H how? How did. Uh, I like Ray. I like Gant. We informed I like him you yesterday. Yeah, we informed you yesterday. I believe it was our Officer Meekins who brought you the news. <laughs> <laughs> oh, fuck. Hey, hey, remember when I told you you shouldn't have cut his pay raise, jackass? Shut <laughs> the fuck up, right, Officer Meekins. <laughs> oh, wait, Mr. Gant, do you know what Mr. Edgeworth did yesterday? Oh, please, do enlighten me. He cut Mr. <laughs> he cut Officer Meekins' pay raise. Oh my worthy! Right, right. What the fuck? <laughs> I told you not to do it. You did it anyway. This is karma coming back swift and fucking hard. Fun karma. Oh, karma's in jail. <laughs> Mister mm. Wright, where have we heard that name before? Oh my god. Do you know where? <laughs> oh wait, I just remembered. I voiced Meekins. Fuck. <laughs> you if you want. Yeah, I we already... No, I wanted to keep doing it. Uh, no, no. no, we already did this cutscene. So you don't have to read the dialogue. <laughs> it's me! It's me! It's me! Excuse me! Excuse me! But... <laughs> you don't mean him? According to Meekins, you didn't accept the report. And you were really mean. Wow, I mean, my... you yelled at him, you made him cry. Jesus, dude. Hard to believe. I can hear him from the fucking hallway. <laughs> Hard to believe. But, but, but your officer, he, he told me. He said the reports had nothing to do with Lo the Lana Sky incident. Detective Bruce Goodman murdered in the police department evidence room. Mr. Edgeworth, the victim's name is written right on top of the report. Ah! Why did your <laughs> officer tell me? Why didn't you read, bitch? <laughs> <laughs> Thank you, bystander in the stands. I appreciate you so much. <laughs> oh my god. I'm not sure if the officer was capable of making the connection. He looked a little dummy. He did seem shallow. Oh god. <laughs> Emma, that's a bit fucking mean. That is very mean. What the heck? In, in any case, this is a serious error. A gross negligence on duty of your part, worthy. Objection! But, but, but <laughs> sir! You, 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 <laughs> but, Dad! You, you could have submitted the report this morning to the court as evidence! That, that I... <laughs> He's just standing there with his condescending smile. I love it. Yes. <laughs> no such luck this oh. time, worthy. Or should I say, unworthy. Ooh. What? Ooh. Ooh. Dude, his nickname just got a downgrade, bro. He just, he literally just, oh no, father, I cast you out your ass. <laughs> yeah. All right, now, oh, God. <laughs> now, what was this? Now, what was that second rule of evidence law? Mm. Well, Mr. Wright, do you remember the second? Uh -huh. Are you trying okay, to make something like Dora the Fuck? Yeah, I was about to say. Oh my god. <laughs> Rule number two, unregistered evidence presented must be relevant to the case on trial. And how is this rule relevant? Normally you submit a list of evidence to be used in court before the trial. This report wasn't on that list. So, uh, what does it mean? I couldn't submit this evidence until a connection was proven in court, which Mr. Wright has just done. Thank you, by the way. Hey. Thanks, Dad. The connection was just proven by Righto over there. Good job, Righto, my boy. Look at that. I'm just. I'm <laughs> <all right. laughs> Let's go! Suck my dick, Edgeworth! 
<laughs> Not tonight, you douchebag! Oh, no! 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 Oh, wow, that that was powerful. Oh. Okay. I heard the building shake when he screamed that. Okay, it seems we've come to the end of this trial. I know you're going through a tough time, Worthy, but with all those rumors. You were even in the defendant's chair just this past December. Remember? You know, that case where your dad died? <laughs> must, <laughs> must suck. Must suck something fierce, huh, Worthy? I apologize for this terrible lack of due diligence on my part. Uh, Mr. Edgeworth! Please, just, just give me one day. I'll get to the bottom of what happened. If it's the last thing I do! Oh, you better get results this time. Really. You have my profound apologies, sir. Poor Mr. Edgeworth. If only he could read. Ah, fuck him. Yeah, if only Edgeworth could read. Oh, well. I don't think there's ever been an error this serious in the history of this court. I will grant <laughs> one further day as the prosecution has requested. Will that be sufficient, Mr. Edgeworth? <sighs> yes, Your Honor. Thank you. Whatever your punishment for this is, for your sake, I hope it's not decisive. Very well. Court is adjourned. 